Welcome Capricorns and um, Aquarians. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes and share. Remember to use a timestamp in order to pick up your videos, okay? So, um, happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday. To all you Capricorn Aquarians cups, which is uh, 18 and 19, 20 begin the Aquarians. So Aquarians, this is going to be a good year for you. Um, uh, you know, be aware, this is going to be an absolutely um, wonderful year for you Aquarians. You're beginning the Aquarians period in time, and this is going to be bringing for it wonderful, wonderful alignment of energies. So, um, this week is a week where it is the changing of the guards, ladies and gentlemen. And when we say the energy of the changing of the guards, that means we are changing from one zodiac sign to the next zodiac sign. Look out for your, look out for your, uh, um, zodiac, um, Sign for um, the um, season of Aquarian. So look out for that. It's going to be coming out right after this video. Um, that one has become a, a really phenomenon one. A lot of people like it. A lot of people um, um, like the whole season thing. So congratulations and let's go in your reading. So we are looking at... Uh, the cycle to the end of deceptiveness. And this is going to affect everyone. If this is your first time, thank you for being here. Please like and share these videos. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Thumbs up so that the video can reach other people um, because of the changes that we're doing, okay? So what we see here is that there is a cycle that is over for a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person in your life. Could be a child, could be a family member, could be a partner. Um, they are now um, realizing um, the deceptive play of this person and what this person have done. They're now recognizing this person can be a man or a woman. Um, it is um, coming up as a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, but it's, it's going to be affecting the Capricorns, whoever this person is. I see they've recognized the deceptiveness of this person. A whole lot has came out and how this person had collaborated with other people in order. And I see you guys are going to be receiving some sort of a new start moving forward. Love is going to be showed to you and showing appreciation. Okay, so wonderful. Um, So recognize that... Uh, a lot of you are going to be having to deal with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. Whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, this person is going to be affecting your life in some form um, or ways. Um, and they have recognized what this person has done and how this person tried to create some sort of an imbalance. I'm opening the window. So, okay be aware of this so um let's look at the capricorn that was born on the 18th so um the capricorns that was born on the 18th i see a tower moment is coming in in this year some blockages is going to be lifted um some of you were blocked for whatever the reason is and i see the blockages is going to be lifted some of you men could be um um, caught up in this tower moment. Um, some of you men and your friends could be caught up in the tower moment. And I see some sort of an ending is coming to some sort of a business relationship. For you businessmen, you businessmen are going to be affected. So men that was born on the 18th of December, your cups, you are Capricorn cups with the Aquarian. I see some sort of a tower moment for you businessmen is coming in. Then we recognize that um, the tower moment is releasing some of you from some sort of uh, um, um, issues that was going on. And this worries is now going to be over. 
because people have now recognized uh, um, what was happening and what was transpiring. So be aware for the people who were born on the 18th of uh, January, some sort of a extreme tower moment is going to be coming in. Be aware of this. So, um, you have some sort of a blockage. Um, some of you could have some sort of a mental blockage or the worries uh, um, that you were going through, the tower moment, how it's affecting you. And that is going to be creating some form of blockage. So be aware of this. Then we're moving in to the people who were born, the last Capricorns who were born on the 19th. The 19th of January, we see an end coming up to the businessmen and they're recognizing the deceptive play of a businessman. Whoever this businessman is, is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. It could be you men. Um, if you're a businessman, some sort of an ending is coming in to some sort of a deceptive play that was carried out. The Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords is never good. I see a whole lot of you businessmen are now worried. Um, whatever that was happening and transpiring, you businessmen are now worried about a situation. For the rest of you, some sort of an end is going to be coming in to some sort of a power play that was transpiring. And a lot of you young men and women between the age of 18 and 45 is going to be affected. Some sort of an ending is coming in. So be aware of this. What is happening and transpiring is that this is a year where endings are um, going to be here for you guys, whatever that was happening and transpire. Um, a lot of young people, especially that was born on the 19th, is going to be feeling this. For the rest, I see a lot of people are going to be happy for these endings that is coming in. And a lot of you are going to be moving forward in a positive direction, moving forward. So this is wonderful. So... I see a lot of secrets and a lot of deceptive play in another place, in another country that some of you businessmen are dealing with. And uh, whatever it was is now coming out and people are aware of what was happening and transpiring. So Capricorn Cups is going to be a year, but it's a year of, uh, um, it's as if you're using uh, the energy of uh, uh, Saturn to cleanse and remove uh, Things, people, and situation that no longer serve you, okay? So, that was it for the Capricorns. Let's look at the Aquarians that is um, born on the 20th of January. I see a new start is here. A lot of you Aquarians is going to be ending um, the inner conflicts and walk away from your partner or walk away from your boss, okay? Or walk away from some sort of an art authoritarian figure in your life and, and moving on to a new start and uh, overcoming some sort of a deceptiveness uh, um, things that was said that was not true and I see that people are going to be offering you love because people are going to be recognizing that people have not been very honest about you and is going to be recognizing this and you're going to be getting a, a good start moving forward and all that was happening is going to be coming out and I see some sort of a apology could be coming to you guys. New love is definitely coming in for you Aquarians. A lot of opportunities are going to be here for you Aquarians. Um, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person that was blocking you, Aquarians, is going to be moved out of the way. This person is between the age of 18 and 45. This person, maybe it's your partner or uh, a family member or a friend that was uh, um, unsavorable. This person is now going to be moving out of the way and people are going to be recognizing and is going to be finding out what was uh, transpiring in your world before you get into this year. So it is not too late to ask for a birthday reading or a year reading. It is very good. A lot of people have been, you know, recognizing people keep on just coming back every year, every year, because it is so focused on the months and exactly what um, is given. So a new start is here for you guys that is born on the 20th of January. Congratulations. And I see some sort of a transition is going to be coming in to an end. And um, um, 
So if you were having like emotional um, problems and that sort of a thing, there is going to be some sort of a resolution um, that is going to be coming in because people are going to be recognizing what is happening, what is transpiring, and it's going to be releasing you. So congratulations. We're moving forward to the people who were born um, on uh, the 21st of January. This is going to be a very lucky year for you guys. So once you were born on the 21st of January, um, it's going to be an extremely lucky year. Now, some of you were going through some sort of a situation with another person in another city or another country that was very deceptive. Whoever this person is, is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. And people are now recognizing that this person has not been speaking the truth and they're recognizing and seeing the truth of who this person is and what this person have done. I see a lot of you, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming in. So it is a year, whatever changes you want to do, go ahead and do these changes because um, uh, it is time. Okay, so this is going to be an extremely lucky year um, for a lot of you who were born on the 21st because uh, people are now recognizing that other people were working against you and as stand and create some sort of a network that was affecting your world and was working against you. And people are now recognizing and seeing the truth of what was happening and transpiring. So this year is going to be a very, very lucky year. Whatever conflicts there is and there was, um, um, there is a group and there's a whole lot of conflicts and you're going to be released out of these conflicts. People are now um, realizing the um, this honest play that was transpiring. And I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, whenever um, the Ten of Swords and um, the, the Eight of Swords is always about dishonest communication. Anything about Swords is here. So a lot of people always say, oh, you're always talking about dishonesty. Yes, because a lot of other people just give you um, some sort of a sweet-coated and I don't sweet coat things. I, I tell you what I see and what is coming up. Okay. So congratulations. You're going to be released out of some sort of a conflict because they're going to be recognizing that someone has not been speaking the truth. And a lot of people have not been speaking the truth and you're going to be res um, getting out. So congratulations. As we look at the people who were born the 22nd of January, we see... Um, another lucky year is coming up, the Wheel of Fortune. You also were connected with some sort of an emotional situation where you found out that people weren't speaking the truth. And what you did was to recognize this and is bringing an end to it. And then I see the energy of uh, whatever hardship there was, uh, I see that you're going to be balanced it out, whether financially or or emotional hardship this year is the year you're going to be balanced it out you're recognizing and seeing the truth of someone or something that was in balance and you are now standing your ground recognizing what was happening and transpiring and uh, is seeing the truth of uh, some sort of a play that people were doing. A lot of you are going to be offered an apology. Some of you could be getting pregnant. Some of you could be meeting someone new. The Ace of Cups is in the uprights. So be aware of this. The energy is that the secrets is coming out. So a lot of you that was born on the 22nd of January, a whole lot of secrets is going to be coming out. People are going to be recognizing that some people wasn't speaking the truth. This is going to be good because it's going to be helping you to move forward. Then we see the energy of um, um, a secret admirer could be there. Some of you are going to be recognizing or finding out that you have a secret admirer and that you're going to be, you know, having a lot of secret admirers. So if you're looking for love, this is going to be a good year um, because a lot of secret admirers are going to be there for you. Congratulations. Now we're moving forward to the people who were born on the 23rd of January. I see people who were born on the 23rd of January is going to be recognizing their enemies. And this is going to be good. 
So 23rd is five and transition is going to be coming up because you're going to be recognizing your enemy and is going to be aware of who has been your enemy all of this time and recognizing that. Now we have the energy of the eight of wands. Um, a lot of information is going to be coming out in this year and you're going to be recognizing who was playing you um, for a very long time. And you're going to be balancing this out because you're going to be recognizing um, that people who you thought uh, um, were your friends is not really your friends. And you're going to be aware of this and this is going to be good. So what we're seeing here is that we have uh, um, the energy of the enemy. And, you know, these people had created some sort of a hardship for you guys, but you're coming out very successful. You have the energy of the nine of cups. Nothing can stop you in this year. You will have to deal with a lot of enemies, but you are going to be releasing them very, very um, fast. You're going to be just releasing them, releasing them very, very fast. So don't... Um, um, worry about this because you end up this year is the energy of the nine of cups. Congratulations. Um, here again, you're going to be dealing with a lot of enemies, but you're going to be overcoming your enemies. So I see a lot of jealousy is going to be around you. A lot of enemies, a lot of, uh, um, green eye monsters and that sort of a thing. People who wanted to throw you under the bus, but yet still you came out on top and this is going to be absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Okay. This year for you guys is not a side for, uh, it's not numbers, but it's more of uh, you working with your intuition and this is going to guide you. As we move to the people who were born on the 24th, um, what we see here is that a lot of you are dealing with some sort of a corporation institution. You are having some sort of a hardship with this corporation institution. It's going to be resolved. I see they're going to be finding out that there was a lot of secrecy um, against you in a corporation institution. And this is going to be recognized. And it's going to be ending in this year. So it's going to be good. So a lot of you could be on the work floor or you were trying to get some sort of a situation, um, um, uh, arrange some sort of a situation and people were trying to work against you. And they're going to be um, recognizing this. A whole lot of you are going to be having secret admirers in a corporation institution um, because you stood up for some sort of an injustice and equality and they're going to be admiring your effort um, and your work, uh, how you have stood up uh, and, and stood your ground against something that you realized that was not honest and they're not recognizing that you are on the right part. And I see a whole lot of people are admiring your um, face, physique of how you a pick up and you stood your ground over some sort of a um, dishonest play that was going on and show up a situation and let people recognize uh, I know what I'm doing and I'm aware of what I'm doing and I see people are going to be admiring you because you stood your ground and they're going to be recognizing this person is someone who is balanced and this person know their work and is balanced and I see this could just end um, help a lot of you to receive some sort of a big um, job improvement that you were not even looking forward for okay so your um, emotional situation is going to be balanced a whole lot of uh, business and job opportunities is going to be coming in Whatever um, paperwork, documentation, or jobs that you're looking, um, jobs is going to be available. And you are going to be very lucky because I see people in power is going to be recognizing your power. Luck is going to be coming up with some of you at work, unexpected luck. And um, unexpected F. Um, unexpected job offers, unexpected luck, anything, any negotiation is going to be a yes and you are going to, this is going to be opening up a lot of new doors for you guys. So again, congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. I really do love your reading. Um, I got to go. But please remember to thumbs up and share these videos so that other people 
can um, recognize what is going on. It is going to be a powerful year. You can still ask for a year reading or a birthday reading in order to see what exactly is going to be coming up for you um, specific in this year. I am off. I got to go. But I'm saying I do love you guys and I wish you guys a really wonderful, powerful year. Um, bringing the changes in this year. I got to go. But I love you. Namaste. Welcome Aquarians. This is the third week of the year 2021. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Happy birthday to you Aquarians. Please go check out the birthday readings. It is at the first part of this video. So Aquarians, what a week, what a week, what a week. Birthday people, go check out your birthday. This year is going to be good for you, Aquarians. No matter what is transpiring, you are bringing in the new age. And it is going to be fab, 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 and more fab. All right, so let's see what is transpiring. So you come in this week where the conflicts is going to be over. Whatever is happening and transpiring, the conflicts is now finally over. So a lot of you Aquarians we're dealing with some sort of a conflict. So whatever this conflict is and was, it is now going to be over. And I see you're going to be leaving this week uh, feeling very, very happy or coming in this week. Some of you are coming in this week uh, with the conflicts being over. Some of you are going to be leaving this week with the conflicts being over. Remember that it's a lot of people, so you're vibrating on different uh, frequency. This time, these readings are timeless. Okay, so remember... So what we see here is that some sort of a changes is coming up and I see multiple opportunities is going to be here for you Aquarians. So this is going to be wonderful. I see changes and a whole lot of new opportunities could be coming up um, and a whole lot of new business and opportunities could be coming up for a lot of you Aquarians. So, all right. So let's look in and see what is transpiring. Now, uh, Monday is a fire energy and uh, Saturday. Um, then we recognize on Tuesday, there is some sort of an emotional situation where um, some of you, the conflict is over. Some of you, the conflict is not, is not yet over. Um, the pyramid and the pinnacle and the crowning of this week, you have to deal with uh, um, uh, the Six of Swords. Now, the Six of Swords is definitely an end that is coming in. An end to some sort of an offer um, that you wanted to offer a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, or a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn would offer you. So maybe this is a supervisor, but um, there was supposed to be some sort of an offer, um, vice versa. And I see that uh, this offer might be in reverse because they're recognizing something and I see that a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman have showed up something and they're recognizing some sort of a play that was um, transpired so communication is going to be coming in on Friday expect communication where a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is going to be offering you something now I see the five of uh, once the competition and conflicts is now over, a lot of money is going to be coming in. And I see communication is going to be very, very clear. I see also where we have um, the energy of the six uh, emotion emotions. And um, a cycle is going to be coming into some sort of an emotional play that was happening and transpiring. And a lot of you are going to be getting out of some sort of an emotional situation that you were in. A lot of you could be dealing with a supervisor that is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Whoever this person is, I see this person is uh, um, offering some of you either financial help or some sort of a new um, stability in order to create some sort of a promising new start for some of you. So this is why... And um, multiple opportunities changes, multiple opportunities is going to be coming in. All right, so let's see what is happening. The conflicts uh, is now over. So some of you were having conflicts uh, um, with a um, Pisces cancer or 
uh, Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion woman. This woman is 50 years and older, could be your mom or a aunt or an older person. They have recognized the deceptive play of this lady and what this lady have done. Um, they have really, really recognized uh, the deceptive play of this lady. This lady is a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion. And I see no love has been offered um, to this person for what they have done. Um, and they're now recognizing what this person have done. Now, I see the page of coin is here. And the energy of the page of coin is seeing some sort of a truth to, to a situation. So it's as if there was some sort of a investigation where they were investigating a whole lot of money. Um, a lot of you are going to be dealing with situation at work or with your business that there was some sort of a false play that was created. I see an end is coming up. 88, expect for some of you, some unexpected money could be coming in. Okay, so expect for some of you, some sort of a unexpected money could be coming in. Some of you could be also leaving a supervisor or walking away from some sort of a, um, whoever this person is, um, it is coming up as a um, Pisces person or someone who had created some sort of a, and had some sort of a conflicts or competition with you, I see that is going to be ending and that is at the workplace, okay? Then we recognize no love is here because they recognize that there was some sort of a deceptive play. And I see people are now finding out what has transpired. I see they're coming down on a Aquarian uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius woman and end is coming in for this woman, whoever this woman is. Um, and I see that some of you, it could be your mom, some of you, it could be your wife or your mom. And I see your mom, some of you, your wife or your mom could be telling you about some money that was lost and they're finding out where the money went. The Ten of Pentacles, so double whammy. This is what I said, Aquarians. This is going to be a very, very lucky year. Um, you come in the Aquarian season showing up and a lot of money is going to be coming in to you, Aquarians. And this is going to be good. And some sort of a um, offer in the past is going to be recapitulate if some of you Aquarians add a uh, uh, money that was lost or stolen, this money is going to be returned or you have to return the money, okay? The outcomes with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, I see three people um, was trying to work against this person. So whoever these three people is and was that was trying to work against this lady, maybe it's your supervisor, it didn't happen. So three, three women... Um, stood up against the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. Maybe it was a supervisor. Maybe it was someone else. You tried to ruin this lady character or this lady repetition. And this lady stood her ground and showed up. Hey, it's not happening. Um, this is not how I, um, I achieve my success. I achieve it in an honest way. I see, um, you Aquarians could have been working and collaborating with other people to work against this lady and this lady stood their grounds. I see changes is going to be coming up for some of you, okay? So recognize what is happening and what is transpired because uh, a lot of you Aquarians tried to work against the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn woman and this woman stood her ground. So when we look at... Uh, the pinnacle of the week, an end is coming in for an Aries Lee or a Sagittarian woman at the workplace. I see people are recognizing that this person was not on top of their game, that this person was not aware of their work and their duties, or this person have overgone their boundaries. An end is coming up for this person at their workplace, and I see a lot of you are not worried a lot of you are kind of happy that this has happened then we see the energy of the eight of cups so a lot of you are turning your backs on your mom or 
um, your wife. Some of you, it's your mom. Some of you, it's your wife. Um, some of you decide not to go that route. Some of you recognize some sort of a deceptive play that has transpired with your mom or your wife. And um, you're trying to balance out the situation. I see there's some sort of an offer for a house. So if you're separating or you're divorcing, you Aquarius is going to be receiving the offer, the offer from a house that some of you wanted. Um, if you're divorcing a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, this person is going to be um, the one who is going to be receiving this uh, position because they recognize that this person is really on top of their games. This person recognizes uh, what is going on. There is a lot of situation that is transpiring where they're going to be finding out that a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person that work in a financial institution has not been honest. Um, and I see that they're going to be given the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person the job or the business because they recognize that this person is more on top of their games and know um, what is the best uh, um, for a client or for a business and they're recognizing this. I see they're coming down on a Aquarian gem, uh, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person. For some of you, it's your mom. They're recognizing something that your mom has done. So um, you Aquarians, a situation with your mom is going to be coming out and they're going to be recognizing that your mom has done something. I see some sort of an ending. I see some of you, if you were working um, and collaborating with your mom, that this could be over because you have recognized that your mom has done something. Okay. So deceptiveness, a lot of you are turning your back to some sort of a deceptiveness. Maybe it's a deceptiveness with your mom or with a business partner or with someone you were collaborating with. And I see you're going to be looking. It's as if you were looking for money that needs to be paid. You were looking and investigating um, money that was supposed to pay. Where did the money go? Because this is, could be a bank or financial institution. And they're going to be recognizing that someone took this money. Okay. I see you are not offering love to anyone at the moment because there was some sort of a deceptive play. And I see it has to do with a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion woman and a Aries, Leo, a Sagittarius woman. They have collaborated in order to work against a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn person. And I see this woman st stood her ground and show up these people for who they are. So Aquarians, be aware you know, whatever you give out will return. Be aware what is happening and what is transpiring because some of you might come up against this person, but it's not it's not someone that you um can come up against because this person is very is on top of what they do. This person is aware and is on top of their work. So be aware. Some of you could be dealing with some sort of a financial situation with your kids. Some sort of an unexpected child support could be coming in and um, this is going to be helping out a lot of you. I see that three women, um, women, be aware of what you give out because I see transition is going to be coming up because uh, um, whatever that was happening and transpiring, three, three of you were either working against or standing up against uh, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. Now, this is a woman and this is a business woman. This woman um, is straight straight to the point, okay? And whatever that some of you were trying to do, this woman has recognized some sort of a play that some of you were trying to do. And this woman cut it down um, directly and stood her ground um, because she has recognized that, you know, it is... Uh, it is really dishonest what was going on. And she has recognized how, um, you know, uh, her kindness, uh, um, how you stop and stood over this kindness. And I see that some of you Aquarian tried to work against this woman and it's all jealousy and hate that is coming in. And you have to recognize that uh, people feel these things and people see these things and uh, Whatever the jealousy and the situation is, I see that um, for
for three of the, um, whoever that was collaborating in order to work against your supervisor or that sort of a thing. It's going to come to an end because people are going to be recognizing that you and others uh, we're trying to create some sort of a problem for this lady. And now they're recognizing the orb of dishonest play that was transpired. So a lot of you are going to be having some sort of an issue on the work floor. A lot of you are going to be um, um, realizing some sort of a deceptive play um, that was created and people are recognizing. In your foundation, no love is showed up. A lot of you could be having some sort of a situation with your child. Or with your wife so this is going to be coming up I see they're going to be recognizing that a whole lot of money um, was not paid and they're going to be coming down on a Pisces cancer scorpion woman I gotta go remember to thumbs up like and share I love you guys namaste welcome Gemini's this week oh, wow this is the third the third week in the year 2021 gemini's wow 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 money 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 oh my god gemini's money in this week okay so ladies and gentlemen you can see that a lot of you business people or managers or unexpected money is going to be coming in for you gemini's so when we come in this week what we're looking at is that there is a block is placed on a Pisces, Cancer, um, Scorpion man. Whoever this man is, this man is 50 years and older. They're recognizing some sort of a deceptive play with this man and realizing who this man is and what this man has done. So they are going to be blocking a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man because they are aware of this man and what this man has created. So, so, so. All right, so the um, crowning of this week is... Uh, a lot of you are dealing with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person between the ages of 18 and 45. And I see some sort of a heartbreak for this person. But you are happy that you overcome um, a situation that this person has created. They are having heartbreaks. You are not. This week is going to be a week of communication. It's not a week to do anything. It's a week to look at people around you. What is going to be transpiring is that a lot of you Geminis are going to be recognizing things about an Aquarian man. Whoever this Aquarian man is and whatever that was transpiring, they're going to be recognizing that an Aquarian man is connected to um, uh, an, Aqu um, an Aquarian man and a, uh, um, and a Libra man was working together in order to create some sort of a problem. But I see Friday unexpectedly money is going to be coming to you and you're going to be, oh my God, I could really use this money. Okay, so Gemini's whatever that was transpiring could be some sort of a lawsuit. A big payout is going to be coming in for you Gemini's or it could be um, that you were ending some sort of a business arrangement. Some sort of a big payout is going to be coming in for you guys. So I see they're going to be blocking a um, Pisces Cancer Scorpion man, 50 years and older, they recognize the horrible play of what this man has done and who this man is and how this man has created problem for other people. A lot of you are going to be um, dealing with a Libran man. Well, that this Libran man is, is helping some of you Geminis to remove yourself from an Aquarian, Gemini, or an, Aqu an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person because they recognize some sort of a horrible play from this person. So people are now seeing the truth that this fire sign person, and it could be people in authority seeing the truth about a fire sign person and how this fire sign person have accumulated a whole lot of money, okay? And they're going to be recognizing how this fire sign person has accumulated a lot of money. Then we see you men 50, um, 45 years and older. Um, the heartbreaks is now going to be over and you have no more inner conflicts because a whole lot of inner conflicts over a whole lot of money that you should have received. And I see the heartbreaks is going to be over because you're going to be um, receiving some sort of a message at the end of uh, the week advising you that this money is going to be coming in. All right. So this is good. All right, let's go into reading and see what is transpiring. So a lot of you are recognizing a corporation institution and some sort of a deceptiveness of this corporation institution, okay? 
um you are showing up people um that people was not on top of their games or was not uh, and i see good news is going to be coming to you so whatever that was happening and transpiring a corporation institution has try um to create uh, some sort of a, a problems or there was some sort of a problems and now um people are recognizing that this uh, um, business or this corporation institution is not what they claims and is not who they claim to be. And I see that people are going to be awarding you. Some sort of a good news is going to be coming in on Tuesday from your boss or people are going to be recognizing what you have done to help them out. Okay. The energy of the four of pentacles is in the reverse and some of you men, 50 years or over, 45 years and older, are going to be um, seeing the truth. So this week is a week of duality and the blindfolds is now off. You men, 45 years and older or men on a whole, the blindfold is now off. Okay, whatever that was happening, whatever that was transpiring, the blind flower is no now off because you're recognizing that a corporation institution have been dragging out, dragging out, dragging out a situation. And you recognize that it has nothing to do with another person, but it has to do with this corporation institution that has been dragging out a situation for a very, very long time. Um, so you have two and four. Two is always about, and this is really the blindfold is off. A lot of you were blindfolded and wasn't recognizing that it was a corporation institution that was dragging out a situation. And now you are recognizing this for yourself. You are going to um, balance out your financial situation. Um, and I see temperance is here. You are putting a lock on a fire sign person, whoever this young fire sign person is. People are now recognizing that this person have created a lot of emotions for you guys. So it could be a younger person and they're recognizing what this younger person have done. A lot of you Geminis are going to be having a new start because people have recognized that a younger person have cost you a lot of pain. Whether this is your child or someone at the work floor, they have caused you a lot of pain. And I see people are now finding out the truth. Your wishes and dreams is going to be coming out because people now recognize that a corporation has been creating some sort of a issue and situation and recognizing that whatever that was happening in a corporation, um, a corporation was, um, um, you know, keep holding back, holding back on something. And now you're going to be recognizing this. So, um, you know, men, whatever that was transpiring, people are now going to be finding out. A lot of you men was heartbroken over a situation. And now you are going to be recognizing that a, a corporation has not uh, been on top of their games and, uh, um, it could be your company or people in your company or some sort of a, um, a resolution with some sort of an authority figure that some of you were dealing with. And you're going to be finding out the truth about a corporation and you're, you're going to be victoriously overcome because some sort of a, um, some of you were blinded and wasn't recognizing what was happening in a corporation institution. You were blinded. You were heartbroken. And it's as if you were waiting, 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 but they were investigating um, someone else. And that is the reason why. So your wait is going to be over because uh, they were investigating a fire sign person that they recognized that this fire sign person was dishonest. And they're bringing some sort of a balance to this. Uh, and I see that a lot of you are going to be having an, a, a new start because they're balancing so it says if some of you were waiting, waiting, waiting for something to be a null or something um, to be a, some sort of a documentation or that sort of a thing. Um, and it could be a situation at work that you are now recognizing that a young fire sign person has not been honest. OK, at the end of the day, um, Gemini's your wishes and dream is going to be coming true. The heartbreaks is going to be over. The inner worries is going to be over. Okay. 
and you are oh my god gemini this is a lucky lucky week for you gemini so gemini this is an absolutely week of luck ace of pentacles is a new start a whole lot of money is coming in for you gemini they're recognizing that a aries or fire sign person a corporation has created a whole lot of issues you're recognizing that a corporation has not been honest um, there was some sort of an emotional imbalance thing people are recognizing in a corporation. Um, and I see good news is going to be coming in um, for some of you. And it's going to be letting you know that you have overcome some sort of a difficulties and heartbreaks that was happening and transpiring. For, um, because you now show up some sort of a um, play that was going on and people are now recognizing the play um that was transpired and uh, realizing that people were uh, in it uh, for their best uh, um you know trying to get the the best out of it and is uh, and try to use their powers in the wrong way i see and some of you are now really going back and thinking about this fire sign person in a co this fire sign person is between the age of 18 and 45 it's an aries leo or sagittarius and you are going to be having a start, but this fire sign person, not because they have recognized uh, that this fire sign person has created a whole lot of problems and issue, um, could have taken a whole lot of money. And this is going to be um, coming up and they're going to be recognizing. So um, Gemini's, this is really, really good. Um, if you had a Gemini boss, this person is going to be blocked. So Whoever had a um, <laughs> Gemini's, if you have a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion boss, this person is going to be blocked. They have recognized what this person have done and how this person have created a whole lot of issues. And a corporation institution is uh, um, realizing and um, recognizing what was played. And good news is going to be coming in for you, Gemini's. You, Gemini's, emotionally are now recognizing what was happening and a balance is going to be coming in and you Gemini's are going to be having a wonderful new story to, um your wishes and dream is going to be coming in and expect some money returning to you Gemini so wonderful wonderful um transition that is coming up for you Gemini's is this absolutely um beautiful um because what is transpiring is that you Gemini's have a career some sort of uh, and um, some sort of uh, um, resolution to some sort of an issue that was transpiring because you recognize uh, that a corporation and you uh, that a corporation was not really um, you know honest in a lot of dealings and uh, you are recognizing um, how this corporation have created a whole lot of problems and they're you know they were not uh, um the process of how they were working was not the correct way truth is going to be coming out they're going to be recognizing what was transpiring you gemini's are really going to be getting a new start if you notice this is sick of pentacles that people are going to be helping you to create a lot of wealth i see people are going to be helping you and making sure that some of you gemini's um money return to you that was taken then um they're going to be recognizing especially for you men some sort of a good news is going to be coming in um for you men for, because that they you recognize what the corporation institution was doing and you're bringing balance to that and your wishes and dream is going to be coming out so this week is about going within and balancing out some sort of an emotional situation um seeing the truth of a corporation institution and of a young fire sign person and what this person was trying to create in your world and standing your ground and recognizing that you have the power and you're taking back your power from anyone who was using your power in order to recipiate you in any uh, in any form and way and you are recognizing that uh, um i will never let anyone you know walk over me and think that they are so um important 
or they use me in whatever way and now you're really recognizing and seeing and you're leaving these people behind you going for a new story i see a lot of you it could be some sort of a payout of a lawsuit that is going to be coming in it can be some sort of a payout of a um, some sort of an insurance situation or money that you were supposed to receive, you didn't receive and it's going to be coming in. Whatever is transpiring, if you have a boss or um, a husband or someone that worked against you, I see this person is going to be blocked because they recognize what this person has done. I do love you, Geminis. This is a beautiful week. This is the third week. Please thumbs up these videos. Uh, if you can't leave a message, thumbs up these videos. I want to say to each and every person, save your money, okay? Because I know you Geminis will lend and lend and lend and lend out. Save your money because at a later date, you never know what is happening. Don't let people um, be aware of what is coming in. Just um, keep your money. You don't have it, you know, and save your money. I do love you guys, but I got to go. Um, share, share, share these videos and uh, thumbs up. I Please remember to subscribe. Namaste. Welcome, 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 Librans. <laughs> this is the third week of uh, um, the year 2021. All right, Librans, you're trying to find inner strength, um, um, problems in your marriage, problems in relationship. I see you're trying to balance out some sort of a situation and it's trying to have some sort of a healing um, coming in. You're dealing with the energy of the devil and um, you got to be aware. You have a couple of major arcana, so um, be aware that some sort of a issues needs to be resolved. Emotional situation that some of you are dealing with a whole lot of emotional situation. It's going to be a very emotional week. For a lot of you, whatever that was happening and transpiring, I see you're going to be really successfully overcoming some sort of a um, play that was created. You're dealing with the devil in this week and you're going to be very emotional, okay? So recognize that. Some of you are going to be having talks of some sort of a new contract. I see the energy of the devil is here, but... Whatever is happening and transpiring, you're going to be getting through this week, okay? A lot of you could be offered a new job, and I see um, you're going to be having some sort of a talks of some sort of a contract. Some of you are going to be very emotional. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, the energy of the devil. Some of you could find out that your partner has cheated on you. Um, a whole lot of situation is coming up. Now, if you notice, you have one, two, three, four five, six major arcanas, six major arcanas, ladies and gentlemen. And what that is saying is that uh, some of you could be dealing with a, um, a woman that is either your mother or your wife. Uh, some sort of a situation, information is coming out. I see that there was some negative play that uh, people from outside, this is outside influence that tried to affect you. And created some sort of a problem for you and a contract. And they're now recognizing what is transpiring. Whoever this woman is, is trying to balance out some sort of a situation for herself. This is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person. A lot of you are standing your ground and trying to resolve some sort of an issue with your husband or your partner. Um, a lot of you are want to, a new start and is looking for some sort of a, a way in order to open up new doors to move you forward in a positive way. But you're dealing with some sort of outside influence that is affecting your world. So let's see. So the nine of pentacles, I see they're recognizing that a Pisces, Cancer or Scorpion woman, um, whoever this person is, could have left a whole lot of money or has um, taken... So some of you pretend as if a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person was your mom. They're going to recognize it's not true. You have took money that wasn't yours, okay? Yes, the Ten of Swords, they're going to be recognizing the deceptiveness of you and your partner, whether your husband or your business partner. I see an end is coming here in because you Libras have created some sort of a problems, 
and I see some sort of a news is coming in from a um, scorpion woman for some of you. I see the conflicts is now over, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring. Whatever conflicts you were having with this person, it's now over. A lot of information is going to be coming in to you. And I see um, whoever um, is dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man, um, um, this man and his family had lied. You're going to be finding this out. I see truth is going to be revealed um, about the outside influence and of who these people and situation are, okay? So, ladies and gentlemen, um, recognize a whole lot of communication over a contract. I see the devil is in the details. A lot of people are standing their grounds. There are people that is uh, um, um, pushing a situation and is... Uh, um, um, trying to get a situation their way. People are recognizing what is going on. A whole lot of information is coming out uh, um, about uh, maybe it's your boss or uh, a business partner, the lies. Okay. So I see um, some of you was working on some sort of a project with a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn man. And they're going to be recognizing that this man has not been honest. I see some sort of a balance is going to be bringing into a contract between you and your boss that is a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I see some sort of a healing is going to be coming in. The three of ones, the energy of the three of ones is that a lot of you are looking to move forward and is looking to leave a scorpion woman behind. Whoever the scorpion woman is, I see that she's going to be like um, sending a lot of message or or communicating a lot of uh, information um, to some of you. But I see some of you um, is already decided, no, I don't want to deal with you anymore. I see that a scorpion woman, um, there is some sort of a um, situation with a whole lot of money. Is this your business partner? Is this your wife? Um, some of you, if you have a scorpion woman that is your wife and you have a child, I recognize that some of you are going to be um, deciding to take your child and leave this woman. This woman only wants money. You recognize that this woman is having an affair with a, a Taurus Virgo or um, a businessman. So I see some of you are going to be thinking about taking your child and move along because this woman is only... Um, our interest is only for money. The scorpion woman interest is only for money. And she is seeing a married man. And this is a married man who is a businessman. And you're going to be deciding to, um, you know, have a custody battle and take your child and move on. Um, then we see the middle of the week. A lot of you are dealing with kids and a lot of inner strength. You're trying to find inner strength to deal with your kids. So, for who have kids, for who don't have kids, is going to be receiving a lot of message. But this message is going to be letting you know that a situation that was going on is finally coming to an end, okay? Then we recognize the energy of the magician. And the energy of the magician is ending some sort of a conflict so that was happening and transpiring, okay? They're recognizing um, that a whole lot of conflicts was created and they are ending these conflicts and is resolving some sort of a problem. A whole lot of you are going to be recognizing that the money that you were paying, giving your child's mother, your child's mother was not using it for the child. So I see news is going to be coming in. And some of you, your child is going to be um, telling you something about the mother. That the mother have another friend or something about the mother and another person and money. So recognize this. Then I see whatever the conflicts and the competition is that was there is going to be over because I see a whole lot of information is now light has been shed to a whole lot of information. People are recognizing what was happening and transpiring. And I see um, a businessman, um, they're going to be recognizing that some sort of a contract that was uh, Career that a businessman career was not was false. So 
they're going to be recognizing that this businessman created some sort of a false contract and they're going to be recognizing what this person have done and is finding out uh, some sort of a uh, deceptive uh, um and, and and deceptive that is the nine of uh, swords ten of swords okay anything that has to do with swords so they are going to be recognizing that a businessman project was um not correctly um it's as if they recognize that pe people did not advise this businessman about what to expect and how to run his business and they're going to be recognizing this and it's going to be really coming down and i see that they recognize that a scorpion woman had collaborated with a businessman in order to create some sort of a false contract and they're now seeing this and they're recognizing what was transpiring so librans um they're you know this is going to be a weak librans because this week is going to be showing up a lot of information it has to do with a contract and i see that they're studying and reading a contract and and and, and studying but it says if uh, someone wants to get out of something um it could be you libran wants to work somebody out of uh, a position or a job position but the contract is being studied at this moment and you guys are recognizing that this contract uh, um they're going to be realizing that this contract this businessman had created some sort of a false contract and false project in order to acquire someone else uh, but uh, um, it's as if uh, they recognize that this man is not very honest. And the people that works around this man is not very honest because they try to use someone else to get their information and their their skills without paying this person um, for their service. And they're going to be recognizing what, what has transpired because they're going to be recognizing that this man whoever this man is and whatever that was transpiring, this man took someone on for their service because this man know that this person is good, but yet still do not want to pay this person um, for their service and is trying to create uh, some sort of an issue and imbalance for this person. But whoever they're planning for, I see this person is already know that... Uh, these people were not honest so this person already know exactly what was going to be coming up and it's i've already recognized that and it's going to be recognizing that these people um were up to no good so whatever um they were creating librans um you're going to be recognizing this so a lot of you librans uh, open up your eyes at the workplace okay and recognize that you're dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn man or a businessman. And this businessman creates some sort of a project or some sort of a false contract. And what is going to be transpiring is that you're going to be recognizing that this person tried to create some sort of an illusion, illusionary situation around you. But you're going to be victoriously successful because though you're emotionally dragged in the situation you're going to be standing your ground and it's going to be ending this situation in a, in a very positive way because you're going to be showing people you know i am not to be played with you know i i can see you a mile coming in and i recognize what you were up to so i am not to be played with so you're going to be understanding and recognizing that yeah you know you knew that this person was not honest and um, you have uh, protect yourself because you recognize uh, that there was some un unfair game or unplayed game that was uh, um that was at hand and now the truth is coming out because i see the conflict is now over and the truth is coming out and people are recognizing that they try to create some sort of a problem for someone in order to make someone else look as if they weren't um doing their work and i see that uh, it they dug a hole 
for you liberants and they are fall in the hole themselves so be aware of what you guys are doing in this week because what we recognize is that whoever dug the hole for you a scorpion woman dug the hole for you a scorpion woman together with a a, a, to, um, a businessman a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn businessman dug the hole for you liberant and they're all falling in the hole a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a uh, news that an ending is here um you're going to be recognizing that the contract was based on lies and deceptiveness and you're going to be recognizing this and realizing that these people were up to some sort of an unfair game but it's as if you liberals are going to be thinking i did know that <laughs> you liberals are going to be thinking i did know that so I was on re already um, realizing um, what was happening and transpiring. It's as if you liberals are going to be recognizing the play of uh, what was happening and transpiring. And you're going to be um, resolving this situation because you recognize that people were playing some sort of unfair games. And uh, you're going to be seeing this. So wonderful alignment of energies is going to be transpiring. People are going to be um, lucky coming out of this week. And whatever contract situation, you're going to be winning and getting out of this contract. Namaste until next time. Please remember to thumbs up, thumbs up, like, shares. Taurus is sun on the horizon. Welcome. This is a week where it's going to be very, very busy, Tauruses. There is no question about this. So, Tauruses, this week is going to be an extremely busy week for you, Tauruses. Whatever is happening and transpiring, it's going to be so busy. This week begins from um, the 18th until the 24th. Some good news is coming in at the end of the week, Tauruses. Some of you are going to be recognizing some sort of a secret with a child, some sort of a new beginning could be coming in for a lot of you. It's going to be an extremely busy week. Everything is in reverse. You Tauruses are recognizing people. This is a week that you're dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman, an Aries Lee or a Sagittarian woman. Um, um, and uh, um, they're coming down on an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. They're recognizing a lot of you are going to be having issues to deal with kids in this week. So be aware of this, okay? Whatever is happening in transpiring. A lot of you who have friends that is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, you're going to be recognizing something. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> something about this person in this week. Whoever is dealing with a Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person, they're... Um, this person have to pay back a whole lot of money and I see they're going to be coming down on this person in order for this person to pay back a whole lot of money. A whole lot of information is going to be coming out in this week. Um, this week is going to be very fast. A lot of you are going to be busy in this week, but it's going to be a very good week. If you um, was open to make some sort of a changes, some sort of a decision, it is a yes week. You're dealing with a lot of people and these people could be friends. So be aware of this. And some of you Tauruses are going to be realizing some sort of a play, um, what your friends have done and have carried out. Remember to use uh, the stamp at the bottom of this video in order to check out who is this Aquarian Gemini or Libra woman, who is this Aries Leo or Sagittarius woman. For some of you, it's your mom. For some of you, it could be someone you are dealing with in uh, at work or in business. Okay, so recognize that. But fast success could be coming out for a lot of you Tauruses because you're recognizing something. Okay, right. Let's go in it. So I see. Um, some of you are going to be finding out something about your partner or some sort of a contract. But it is coming up as if it's your partner who is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman and a fire sign. So a lot of you are going to be having some sort of a double um, energy with a Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person. And an end is coming up for this person because they recognize uh, something that this person have done. 
and they're realizing that this person have created some sort of a problem, some sort of an issue, some sort of a secrecy. Maybe it's your children, mother, which is a fire sign person. See, an end is coming up for this person. They recognize that this lady, um, together with a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person, have created some deceptive play. So you, Taurus, is, is going to be recognizing that these two women, uh, whether these two women is, um, they have created some sort of a deceptive play. And they're recognizing that it has to do with a Pisces woman, whoever the Pisces woman is. I see love is going to be offered to you, Tauruses. Um, you, Tauruses, could be meeting someone new in this week. Whoever this person is, it could be an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. But uh, I see new love is coming in. Some of you, um, to, together with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, is going to be recognizing that a fire sign person was very dishonest. Okay, a fire sign person was very dishonest. The Ace of the Pentacles, where some news is coming in that you Tauruses um, have to pay back some money or you could be receiving some money. A new start is going to be coming up for some of you Tauruses. You came down on a situation and shed light on a situation. Okay, then we see that some sort of a situation the fastness balance is going to be coming in because uh, our situation is now going to be resolved. So a whole of you Tauruses are dealing with kids. Whatever is happening and transpiring, um, some sort of a, un, uh, um, you know, uh, play that was carried out against your child is now going to be coming out, and people are going to be recognizing it. Okay, new love is coming in. Some of you could be. Returning to the ex and some sort of a new start. Some of you want some sort of a new start with your friends. And it's open for some sort of a new start with your friends. So whoever an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person is, I see um, the, they found out what this lady have done. And that this lady have worked together with a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion person. And I see an end is coming up to these two women because people are now recognizing that these two women had worked together in order to create a whole lot of problems. So, um, the Knight of Pentacles is showing up that um, a couple had stolen a lot of money or a couple have created some sort of a problem for other people. So this week, Taurus, is, is about deceptiveness, but you're going to be overcoming this deceptiveness because you're going to be recognizing um, the play that was happening and transpired. So a lot of you who were having some sort of an issue with an Aries or Sagittarius person, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion person, they're going to be recognizing that these two people have created some sort of a um, dishonest situation, the Seven of Swords. And you're going to be showing that up. And I see that a couple... It's going to be recognizing that there was some sort of a dishonest play that was created. And it's going to be standing up against this. New love is going to be coming in for a lot of you Tauruses. This new love is going to be helping you to open up doors for you. And it's going to be clearing up some sort of an issue that was transpiring. Um, a lot of you are open for some sort of a new start with friends. Um, but I think look look closely because these people are not supposed to be in your world. If you ended the friendship, that means that these people were not supposed to be in your world. So I see they've found out the secrets about an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius woman and their child. And love is going to be offered to you and a new start is going to be offered to you, Tauruses, because they recognize um, that two women were working against you, Tauruses, okay? And they're going to be ending the deceptive play of these two women. These two women was a, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion, a Aries, they are in a Sagittarius, and they recognize this. A new contract is going to be coming in for you, Tauruses, and you're going to be having a new start moving forward because now things are clear as to what was happening and transpiring. So fastness, it's going to be fast. It's going to be a lot of work. Um, 
a lot of people are going to be involving in resolving a whole lot of issue. I see some of you Taurus is going to be, um, you know, love is going to be shown to some of you Taurus is for helping to resolve some sort of on, um, um, unsolved situation and you have resolved it. Um, money could be turning to you, returning to you, or you could be receiving message that money is going to be returning to you. This is uh, um, a week where good news is coming in that you're going to be successful. Um, do you really want to make any decision in this week or change anything? No, because this week is that you're successfully overcoming some sort of a on um, this honest play that was created and, and, and ladies and gentlemen stop asking why i speak about dishonesty you have to understand the energy of each card to recognize what is coming up anything that has to do with swords especially the seven of swords is about dishonesty a lot of you who were in a relationship with a pisces cancer or scorpion is going to be finding out that this woman has not been honest. You're going to be finding out the truth about this woman. And uh, um, this woman, I see some of you could be deciding um, to leave this woman and your child behind and go in search of a new and better life because you recognize that whoever this lady is, so this lady has not been very honest. And they're going to be recognizing that um whoever this lady is whether it's a pisces cancer or a scorpion um has not been honest and have created a, a whole lot of issue together with a aries the or sectaris person they're going to be seeing the truth of what was happening and transpire a whole lot of you are going to be balancing out issues and problems with your children um you could have been having inner conflicts with yourself um you're going to be realizing that uh, um your partner could have deceived some of you and you're going to be finding out the truth of what your partner did so a lot of information is going to be coming out and i see news is going to be coming in but whatever the news is is the news is that you have successfully overcome some sort of a problem that people had created for you and uh, some of you are going to be receiving if you are waiting on some sort of information is going to be a yes and you're going to be successfully moving forward in a very very positive way and understanding how you have resolved a whole lot of situation by looking at what was happening and transpiring and recognizing um that you were standing in your truth you were standing in your truth you are standing in yourself you are recognizing um things that was transpiring around you and you were taking back your powers at the same time and this is going to be good so taurus says um you know go check out who is this aries Lee or sagittarius person who is this pisces cancer or scorpion person who is this aquarian gemini or libra person a lot of you men could be involved with these women and if you're involved with these women i see a lot of you tauruses could be receiving some sort of information about a aries Lee or a sagittarius person and recognizing who this person is and is going to be balancing out some sort of a problem that was created and is going to be bringing back some sort of a positive successful alliance of energy um, in the li your lives, but also the lives of these people. So of you, if your mom is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, she could be telling you something about your aunt or her friend, some sort of a deceptiveness that she recognized about a fire sign woman. Some of you, if your um, mother is an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius, you're going to be recognizing that your mother, together with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, whether it's a sister or a family or a friend, had created some sort of a deceptive move and an end is coming in. You, Taurus, is going to be getting out of this and it is going to be positive. So please like and share these videos um, and thumbs up if you can't leave a message. And we are going to be aligning the, the energies. I want to say namaste until next time. Welcome, Virgos. This is the third week of the year 2020. 
20, um, 21. The year this week is beginning from the 18th until the 24th. I want to say thank you for being here, Virgos. Wonderful week for you, Virgos. <clears throat> You're going to be overcoming some sort of a situation and moving forward. Here you have luck is here for you and you're going to be overcoming some sort of a situation. You are dealing with a fire sign person. You're going to be recognizing some sort of a on Alex play, um, play that was uh, um, happening. You're going to be moving forward and overcoming a fire sign person and some situation that a fire sign person bring in your life all the ladies 50 years and older there could be some sort of a health issue that you're going through you could recognize this maybe you have done some sort of a test and the test is going to be coming back um that you have some sort of a health issues that you have to deal with so virgos uh, ladies, um, say 45 years and older, some sort of a health issue is going to be showing up in this week. So we'll recognize this. Okay. Um, it's all about, uh, um, whenever the tree comes up, it's all about your health. Okay. And it's going to be affecting ladies, 45 years or older, or ladies on a whole could be coming, um, um, and recognizing some sort of a health issue in this week. Then we see um, the two making a decision. Some sort of a new start is going to be coming in. You are now recognizing your enemies. Um, this is going to be good for you, Virgos, because you made a decision about a fire sign person and you overcome a fire sign person for what they have done. You make a decision to speak the truth in the week and now you're going to be having a new start and you recognize who was playing you and who was on dishonest to you some sort of a new start is going to be coming in for you virgos your emotion is going to be balanced especially emotional situation with family is going to be imbalanced and it's going to affect the women so health issues is going to be coming up um not only for men but also for women um some of you virgos recognize that a fire sign person was not honest and i see this is going to be coming out and people are going to be aware of this so let's look so i see some sort of an emotional situation that you're going to be properly balancing out so that is going to be good i see a corporation institution is going to give you virgos a new start and that is going to be good they have recognized um, who this fire sign person is and is going to be um, bringing down this fire sign person for whatever they have done and is going to be giving you a new start. Again, this um, um, wishes and dream is coming to Virgo. So you Virgos, um, your wishes and dreams comes in and your emotion is going to be balanced. I see that a corporation institution is recognizing um something about some of you men um and uh, uh, um your business a whole lot of burdens and they're recognizing some of you businessmen um what was happening i see you virgos is going to be using the sword of truth when it comes to wednesday friday um especially friday you're going to be taking down your enemy by communicating i see also the energy of the queen of pentacles so you ladies you virgo ladies and men are standing up in this week and you virgo women is going to be recognizing your enemy in this week and that could be on friday a lot of you virgo women is going to be recognizing your enemy i see you virgo women protecting your family and i see a cycle is going to be over you virgo women your wishes and dreams is going to be coming out um, overcoming your enemy you are now seeing something about a Libran and that a Libran woman has not been very honest I see that um, a lot of you um, Virgo women is going to be a little bit surprised um, you were hoping that it wasn't true but you're going to be recognizing um, that it is true that a Libran woman was not honest so I don't know if you are Virgo, a Libran sunrising or a Virgo sunrising, you're going to be recognizing some dishonest play um, that was transpiring. Okay, so it is as if some of you are going to be recognizing 
and seeing some sort of a heartbreak so that came in. Um, you ladies especially is going to be recognizing because I see you ladies is going to be standing your ground, speaking your truth, taking down your enemies. And I see a law of happiness with the family is going to be here. A complete new cycle is coming up for the family, okay? Whoever a liberal woman is, uh, I see they're recognizing the truth about this liberal woman. I see they recognize what this liberal woman have done. I see they're recognizing that it's not the first time this liberal woman has created this problem and truth is coming out. So whoever have a liberal as a friend, they're going to be recognizing. Um, I see this liberal woman is very sad. Very sad because they recognize who this liberal woman is and what this liberal woman has done. So I see um, a lot of you are going to be making some sort of a decision about your business, especially businessmen. You're sitting down and in the plan phase of uh, what to do on Monday with your business because there's a lot of burdens, burdens the home situation. Then I see some sort of a, um, a, a corporation institution is, um, you know, wants to give uh, um, some of you businessmen a new start. So this will be coming up there recognizing um, that this businessman was not aware that uh, um, that he was not told how to do business and they're recognizing this and they're going to be given the stories Virgo um, of Capricorn businessman and he will start because they recognize that this man was not aware of uh, the rules and regulation of some sort of a business in an international uh, internationally or so and they're going to be giving this man a new start because they recognize that this man was not aware and wasn't told and whoever that was running this man business was not um doing it in the efficient way a lot of you women women um virgo women your emotion is going to be balanced you're going to be recognizing who your enemies are in this week and you're going to be standing your grounds using your sword of truth in order for you to move forward okay so however this is happening and transpiring you're going to be recognizing that this week is a week where a lot of you are moving forward a lot of you are surprisingly finding out something about a Aries Lee or a Sagittarius person and a corporation is now aware of who this person is and you Virgo showed up that this person is not honest and what you Virgos have done is to re let people know no nope, this is not the person that wasn't the person um that wasn't the person and I see a corporation is going to be giving you Virgos another chance so so Virgo men your problems is going to be over. You're going to be coming out of this situation because you honestly told the truth and try to um, resolve a situation um, for a Capricorn man. And your emotion is going to be balanced and you're going to be recognizing that a fire sign person have created a whole lot of issues and you're going to be bringing this to balance, okay? A new start is definitely going to be coming out for you Virgo ladies and men 45 years and older. So Virgo um, business people 45 years and older or if you are a manager, some sort of a new start is going to be coming in. And I see especially you ladies are, um, you know, taking, using the sword of truth against your enemy and is standing your ground and it's going to be recognizing and ending a cycle with people who have tried to create and bring um, this honest play in your world. So I don't know who is married or who have a relationship with a um, with an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. I don't know who is married, who is dealing with this person. They are definitely going to be recognizing what is going to be happening and what is going to be transpiring because they're now recognizing um, who this lady is and um, that this lady has not been honest. So, so whoever you Virgos are, are going to be showing up that this woman, whoever this woman is, is not very honest. 
okay, that this person has played some sort of a um, two-sided game and was very deceptive and you're going to be recognized that an Aquarian Gemini, uh, uh, a Libra woman is not, uh, is a friend enemy. A Libra woman is a friend enemy. Um, a Libra woman um, has a pretend to be a friend, but it's not really a friend. This person is doing things uh, and pretending to be a, a friend to you, but you need to realize, realize uh, who this woman is, okay? It is a karmatic situation. Could have been a sister, a sister-in-law. Um, but recognize that a lot of you are going to be dealing with a Libra woman, okay? And you're going to be recognizing that this woman is not really honest. You're going to be recognizing and finding out that this woman has been playing you and has been, like, really not telling you the truth, is it that this person hiding the truth from you? But this person is not really um, telling you what exactly is transpiring. You're going to be recognizing this all for yourself. So a corporation institution is going to be ending some sort of a burden. So, and it's going to be making um, a decision. And it's going to be giving a lot of you Virgo women some sort of a new business because they recognize uh, you cut between and recognize uh, what is good and what is not good and you 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 know you get to the point uh, and you show up for yourself and i see promotion could be coming up for a lot of you women 50 years and older or 45 years and older because a corporation institution have uh, recognize uh, that you are on top of your game. The energy of the hangman is here, and I see with the energy of the hangman, a lot of you are going to be recalculating your next move. This is going to be good. So it is really a positive week. I would not say that you should make any risk in this week. Some sort of unexpected um, situation is going to be coming out where you're going to be um, finding out something about some sort of unexpected news about a fire sign person. You're going to be finding out something about this fire sign person. Um, a lot of you are going to be planning and it's going to be taking and creating a new start. Um, some of you men are definitely going to be receiving some sort of a new um, offer, some sort of a new business offer. Because so, uh, I see that some of you men recognize uh, that someone is in your best interest. Whoever this person is and whatever is going on. Um, a lot of you are recognizing that someone is really in your best interest uh, and is going to be helping you. And some of you Virgo men are going to be choosing um, uh, to resolve a situation um, and help. Um, if, if you notice, you businessmen are going to be receiving another chance uh, and wants someone to be on your team. Um, so I see a new start is going to be coming up for you businessmen. And um, if you were a couple and there was some sort of a unbalanced emotional situation, I see this is going to be resolved, okay? So let's say that... Uh, you have a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn wife. I see you're going to be wanting to end a situation and resolve the situation between you and this person. It could be an ex, it could be um it could be an ex, but it could also be um you know someone who is really caring and is going to be resolving and helping you to resolve some sort of a situation. So I see. You're not going to be getting it for something, you Virgo men, because I see that you recognize that a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn has took down your enemy. So this woman, this woman recognized that people 
were not working in your best interest. And this woman has recognized it. And she is going to be making sure that uh, um, the situation is balanced out. And I see that you men are going to be communicating um, with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman, letting this person know, hey, I want to move forward with you and I want you um, to be the one to run my business or you to be the one that is going to be helping me to run my business. So I see that um, you Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn um, men, and especially you Virgo businessmen, your burdens is going to be over because I see an ending is coming into that. And it's because of a, another um, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn woman is going to be helping you out to resolve your burdens. So, and I see that you are going to be... Um, Saying to this person, hey, um, you know, I rather will, I rather want to move forward with you. Um, I think that it is best that I move forward with you. I rather moving forward with you, um, you know, with you looking at my business. And I see that, uh, um, you know, you're going to be recognizing that, um, your corporation needs someone who is a uh, aware of what they're doing okay so i see um this woman is going to be using the sword of truth taking down your enemy you virgo men is going to be recognizing that a liberal woman was not being honest to you i see that you are going to be saddened because you had put your faith in a liberal woman and is now recognizing that this uh, liberal woman had not um didn't have your eyes uh, your eyes um it's as if you gave and put your faith in a liberal woman and recognize that this liberal woman was not uh, working in your best interest okay and you're going to be um like you know asking maybe it's another uh, is a taurus virgo or a capricorn woman you're going to be asking a taurus virgo or a capricorn woman to help you um and you know there was some sort of a honoris between you and this person and you're going to be saying to this person can you help me and come on board full time in order to resolve these issues that i'm having so be aware of this okay so Truth is going to be revealed. I see a lot of you, Virgos, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true. And a new cycle is going to be broken for you and your family, which is good. A lot of you, Virgo men and women, is going to be recognizing that your greatest enemy was a liberal woman. Whoever this liberal woman is, was basically your greatest enemy. And this liberal woman was basically creating a whole lot of issues and problems for you without you even recognizing that this woman was not in your best of interest. So um, recognize this maybe it's your partner, maybe it's this a business partner, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, you're going to be recognizing it is time that you change um, who this person is because you recognize that this person, you know, have been taking you for a ride and was not... Uh, um, you know, you know, sending you in the right direction. And now you have recognized what was happening. So, um, I'm wishing you guys a lot of success. Um, you're going to be really overcoming some sort of a problem, um, that a liberal and a fire sign person, you're going to be moving forward. And I see that you're going to be trying to create some sort of a new start, uh, in resolving a whole lot of uh, um, issues that was going on. And I see you men are going to be recognizing that someone is there protecting you on your journeys moving forward, whether it's in business or whether it's in your private life. I got to go. Don't forget to a thumbs up and subscribe. Share, share, share. Namaste. Welcome Capricorns. This is the third week of the year. 2021 i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back wow capricorn what a week what a week what a week 
Peace is here and a new star to come for you Capricorns. Wow. Okay, Capricorns, whatever that was going on, the end to the jealousy and the hate that was transpiring. There was a whole lot of lies, Capricorn. So this week is uh, peace is here and new start is coming up for you, Capricorn. Um, the lies and deceptiveness of people. Um, they're going to be recognizing what was going on and the end is coming to the jealous and hate that was happening around you Capricorns. Congratulations again Capricorn. Another wonderful week. I hope you're enjoying these energies because once you were worked against, once you are a Capricorn that is really honest and upright, so this energies, these energies are going to be finding peace and bringing back peace in your world. So this week is from the 18th until the 24th. Please remember to use the timestamp the name um, at the bottom of this video. Please share, share, share these videos. Share, just share and thumbs up. All I ask is to be shared and thumbs up. Okay. Um, go and check out the people who are going to be coming up in your reading. But you have a major economy. You're cleaning up. You're using um your um, energy of Saturn to clean up uh, some on a like things that was going on and is showing up and resolving some sort of a situation. You're ending some hate and jealousy that was coming at you and people who were lying about uh, money. They're going to be recognizing what was happening. So what we have here is the energy of the hermit. The energy of the hermit is shedding light and this whatever that you're bringing to light a tower moment is going to come down um because people recognize uh, that uh, something was not above water so you are coming in this week shedding light on something and with that a tower moment is coming down and then they're recognizing and ending some sort of a uh, uh, communication and I see a lot of you are going to be um, get a new start and a lot of money is going to be coming in and they're going to be recognizing that people have not been speaking the truth and they're going to be bringing a hand to the people who were creating a lot of hate and jealousy around you Capricorn. So 10, 10, 10 is your energy. 10 is about new start um, and this new start is going to be um, bringing in a whole lot of money um and light is shedding on some sort of a documentation that is going to give you a new start a tower moment and an end is coming in where some money was blocked from you and the money was taken by someone else and they're recognizing who took the money so end is coming in um and peace is coming in because you're sh shedding light on something that was um transpiring with a family so an end could be coming in for a family. A tower moment is coming out for a family. Um, twice the energy of death. Someone could be passing away. A family member or um, someone could be passing away. All right. So when we receive the energy of death twice, some of you could be hearing um, that a family friend, yes, a family friend is going to be passing away. Okay. So Capricorns recognize and be aware of this, that a family friend is going to be passing away. Uh, some of you, a family, a tower moment is coming down for a family also. They're recognizing um, that people are trying to work against a family and they're recognizing the horrible play that people have done to a family. I see you have a double whammy 88 and this is going to be fast and a whole lot of business is going to be coming in um for you capricorns a lot of fastness uh, um a whole lot of business is uh, going to be coming in for a lot of you then we recognize an end so it is twice endings there's a lot of endings that is uh, happening and transpire a whole lot of endings um some sort of an emotional situation ending with friends, ending with friendship. You're going to be f receiving some sort of information 
um, about um, a friend and their family. Some light is shed on a friend and their family. You're going to be recognizing and receiving that. Now, um, whatever the competition is, it is now over. No more, no more competition. An end to the competition. An end because um, a lot of you are going to be recognizing that a friend was trying to compete against you and an end is coming in. I see you are going to be receiving some sort of a message that an end has come in. Um, and I see a lot of money is going to be paid out to you. So it could be the end of um, a contract or the end of a legal situation. And they are now recognizing that a friend or some sort of a competition was around you. Someone wanted to compete with you and they're now recognizing this and an end is coming in. The Ten of, of Swords, um, the truth is coming out about some horrible, horrible um, play with a whole lot of money and the truth is now coming out and I see you are looking uh, to find better waters, looking to find better shores and leave these lies and jealousy behind you. So you're definitely, definitely looking for better shores. Um, you are really looking for better waters and leaving some sort of a really on, um, this honest play, um, behind you. So this is a good week. Um, this is a very good week because uh, this week is about peace coming in and a new start. It's about some sort of a family ending with a family because the truth as a light has been shed on a family. And I see an end, a tower moment is coming down for this family because they're recognizing um, that there was some sort of a, um, on Alex. So twice the energy of the 10 the Ten of uh, Swords, and the Ten of Swords is about on a like uh, play that was transpired. And I see, you know, truth is coming out because fastness, because um, it's as if you shed light uh, on what was going on, shed light on some sort of information, documentation. I see a tower moment is coming down on the family because they recognize that the family was very dishonest and an end is coming into this family. Again, that is here where the end of some sort of a competition, um, a lot of people were competing against you. And I see um, a tower moment is going to be coming down and the competition is going to be over. I see some of you, um, some sort of a transition is coming up with a friend and you're going to be receiving um, this information and money is going to be returning to you. So whoever this friend is and whatever that was transpired, they're going to be recognizing that this friend was not being honest and um, that this friend tried to take money and was competing against you and tried to take money from you. And I see that this money is going to be returning. So whoever this friend is, they're going to be recognizing that this friend has been deceptive, really deceptive. This friend um, was not being honest. So, and if you notice, there is no people because the major arcanists are coming in in order to help you to resolve a really dishonest play. An end is coming in um, to um, uh, a whole lot of uh, business is going to be coming in. So if your business was blocked, light is going to be shed and people are going to be recognizing why they block your business is because they recognize that you are very good at what you do and people at block your business and they're going to be removing this blockage and it's going to be sending more business to you. I see, especially honest business women, you're going to be receiving a, a lot of business because they're going to be recognizing that a group of people were blocking your business and now they're going to be lifting this block and it's going to be sending in a whole lot of business for you. I see a lot of you are going to be um, turning your back to some sort of a conflicts with a child. Um, and you're ending this conflicts. Whatever it is with a situation with a child, you're ending this conflicts. Okay. Because you recognize that a child was unfairly treated 
and you're ending this conflict. So I see a family, some sort of a, a family situation where you're going to be ending a conflict with a child because you're recognizing what a family have done and how a family have created some sort of a problem. And an end is going to be coming to this family because they're going to recognize that this family was not being honest and um, the competition is now going to be over and you Capricorns are going to be ending the week receiving a whole lot of money, some sort of a payout because they recognize that people were not being honest and was trying to work against you and was uh, putting some sort of a block up against you. And they're going to be recognizing what these people were doing and that it was all caused by jealousy. Um, and because of this, I see that a lot of doors are going to be opening up for you because they recognize that uh, you have been on top of your game and you have been, you know, walking the right part. So, you know, if you did something and you expect that, um, yeah, you're going to be um, getting out of it. No, because it's as if uh, this week the major economy comes in to shed light uh, and it's saying you need to end the situation because uh, um, whatever that you're doing is, uh, um, uh, you know, you have gone down the wrong part, part of the street. And it's as if uh, the major arcana is coming in and saying, listen, Capricorn, um, you know, you have made a huge, huge uh, um uh, and creates a uh, you uh conflicts and chaos uh, and ne now you need to get back on your part uh, so i see a lot of people especially people who are f frequencies in a fifth dimension frequency where you are just cutting through things and you get straight to the point you don't create drama you don't want any drama around you you're going to be getting out of some sort of a situation and really um looking and rec uh, recognizing the horrible play that people have created and this ending of the jealousy, lies and deceptiveness is going to be coming out. So it's going to be a very fast week. A lot of you could be receiving a lot of business. Very fast week. I see a tower moment is going to be coming down on a family. It's not showing up whose family, um, but I see some huge tower moment is going to come down on a family. Um, a family a friend could be passing away or someone in your family could be passing away in this week. I got to go, but I am saying to you guys, be careful out there. And they are going to be recognizing that an Aries Lee or a Sagittarius person was not speaking the truth. And they're going to be recognizing that this person have took money on the false pretender. Whoever this is, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person, and they're going to be ending this because they're going to be recognizing that this person was uh, um, very, very dishonest. Uh, and this person tried to manipulate a situation in order to get um, in life. And I see end to the lies and deceptiveness. Uh, and uh, um, you have uh, 77, you have um um nine and ten of pentacles which is good money is going to be returning to you and people are going to be recognizing what was happening and what was transpiring so kudos to you um capricorns i um you know it's about uh, you yourself recognizing uh, what you have done wrong but yet still correcting um this at the same time um ending a situation where a family was creating a lot of problems and issue and you're realizing what was happening that this family has created so much problems for you and they're going to be ending a tower moment is going to be coming down on a family okay because they recognize that this family have not spoken the truth we are really not seeing whose family it is so you will be aware of this uh, when you get uh, into the week, you will find out whose family is this. There's basically not a lot of people in this reading, only that some money will be returned to you. So um, the cross is here. Um, deceptiveness uh, um, comes to an end. An horrible situation. A lot of you is going to be coming out of in this week. Let go and move on. Namaste. Welcome, Aries. This is the third week of January of the year 2021. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. 
So, Aries, and this week you have major arcana. Some of you are dealing with some sort of a conflict between you and a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. I see they are going to be ending this situation and bring an end to it and resolve a situation for this lady because they recognize that some of you ladies, some of you were had created some sort of a situation. So, whatever that was transpiring, some of you could have had a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. Um, this is coming up as a Taurus person that there was some sort of a conflict with, whether it's your mom or it was some sort of a corporation institution. And I see that this person is going to be ending this conflict and is going to be resolving a situation because they rec recognize uh, that some sort of a, uh, uh, issue was going on that needs to be resolved so a whole lot of you could be having conflicts with a friend so you can see this energy that uh, a whole lot of you are going to be in conflicts with a friend and um, you Aries so um, recognize this and I see some sort of a communication is coming from a friend that a cyclist over with a corporation institution I see the wheel of fortune is uh, um a Taurus woman is going to try to resolve some sort of a problem that is going on and I see um a lot of you are going to be um you know waiting whether it's your mom or whether it's a friend or a family member some of you could be di divorcing a Taurus person and I see some sort of a resolution is going to be coming up. So I see you're having some sort of a karmatic issue with friends, a whole lot of communication. Some sort of a hardship is going to come to an end. And I see that a woman, a Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn person, a corporation institution is going to be making sure that this is brought to an end. So let's see. I see communication about a project that some of you are working on. Um, I see our chips, so some of you are really dealing with some sort of our chips, some sort of problems. And I see that some of you want to move forward. Some of you are dealing with a situation with a car and some of you want to move forward. Now, whatever it is, whether it's a situation with a car from in the past, I see that you want this to be resolved. And I see some sort of information is going to be coming in. And I see some sort of a new start could be coming up for a whole lot of you who were open for some sort of a new start. And I see the energy of the devil is in the details. The devil is in the details. So what we're recognizing is that uh, a lot of you are dealing uh, with um, some sort of an issue, some sort of a communication is coming in. And I see some sort of a resolution is going to be here. A corporation institution have recognized uh, that there was some sort of a false play um, in uh, um, the past. So what is transpiring is that a lot of you were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. And I see that whatever that was transpiring, a lot of you have to return a whole lot of money to this person, a bank financial institution is going to be awarding some of you to to, to um, return some money to this person. I see they have recognized that you, Aries, have used this person information to acquire some sort of a um, business stability for yourself or for your family. People are now recognizing, and I see that they are going to be stepping in and is going to be ending the situation and resolving the situation so um some sort of a situation in a company um they're going to be ending because um it could be your company or in a company that you aries work they're going to be ending some sort of a problem that was there so communication is going to be coming in about the project um and again the devil is in the details whatever is happening the devil is in the details. I see your hardship is going to be over um, because you're going to be recognizing that people were playing some sort of a um, dishonest play. Um, you guys have uh, twice the energy of the five of pentacles. So, and they're all in the river. So um, whatever hardship that some of you were dealing with, uh, with a 
a businesswoman, I see they're going to be recognizing what was transpiring. I see a lot of you, some sort of a communication is coming in about a, a car or moving forward. So uh, whatever is transpiring, I see that you Aries are going to be having some sort of a problem, a conflicts with uh, um, travel. Um, so be aware of this. So then we see some sort of a hardship that was going on um, is going to be resolved. And whoever that that have done something against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, this person is going to win and win bin because a corporation institution have recognized that uh, um, you, um, Aries, I don't know what you have done to this lady, whether it's a bank or a financial institution, it's going to be recognizing that this lady um, is you are not uh, this lady. So it's as if you, um, Aries, had used a woman, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman information in order to acquire a car or in order to acquire some sort of a business relationship and they're going to be recognizing you're not this lady. This lady is, uh, is, is, is a, um, a business woman. This, you're not this lady. And they're going to be recognizing that you're not this lady. But whatever has transpired, they're going to be recognizing so a bank financial institution or an auto dealer um is going to be recognizing that you Aries had access someone else's information saying that it was you and they're now recognizing that you're not this person so I don't know if you use someone else's information to acquire a business or a house or an apartment they're going to be recognizing you are not the person and that a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is the person. So it's like a house or an apartment that some of you Aries use someone else's name or um, to, to acquire this um, property or to rent this property. And they're going to be recognizing you're not this person. This person is not in the country or this person is not in the state and they're going to be recognizing that this person had no idea that you have been using their information to rent some sort of an apartment or buy something so i see um a lot of problems is going to be coming up for a lot of you aries who have done that or if it was vice versa um it could be identity theft where they recognize that you aries is using a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person information to acquire stability for yourself. And they're going to be recognizing this and they're going to, and that's why there is some sort of a problems with travel documents because they're going to be recognizing that either a car that you have or a travel documents is in another person name and you are not the person and they're going to be recognizing this. So I see a situation with um, a project um is going to be moving on for some of you so some of you Aries was hoping that the project will move on um I see um some sort of a complication that is transpiring people are investigating this and recognizing that you Aries have not been honest a bank or a financial institution or a mortgage broker or um is recognizing that you Aries have used someone else's name in order to acquire a mortgage and they're now recognizing who this person is and what you have done um a corporation institution is going to be making some um decision and it's going to be made in favor of a taurus virgo or capricorn business because they recognize uh, that this taurus virgo or capricorn woman is on the top of their game and recognize that this person is the owner of a business but also that this person is in um is standing in their power and is recognizing that this person is aware of uh, uh, how a business is set up, how a business is run. And uh, it could be that some of you were having some sort of an issue because I see that some of you are having an issue at the workplace. And it's as if some of you tried to throw a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn under the table and they're recognizing that you were the one who have done it and you are the one that have created a whole lot of problems for this lady and um, 
um, they're going to be recognizing this and trying to resolve it. So I see an end is coming in, Aries. There is no question. An end could be coming in with a friend, some sort of a friendship. An end could be coming in, some sort of a resolution is going to be coming in in a corporation institution because they're going to be recognizing something that you, Aries, have done and it's going to be bringing in some sort of an end to some sort of a um, issues that were occurring. I see a whole lot of processes, a whole lot of changes is going to be coming in. And a lot of you, Aries, is going to be having some sort of a problem with travel. I don't know how that is coming up. Is it in a week or um, is it in the future? But I see a lot of you could be having car problems in this week. That is definitely going to be coming up or a resolution to your car problem. But a lot of you are having some sort of a competition with a friend. But I don't even think that this person is seeing you or even um, showing that you exist. So I don't know who or what you're having, but some sort of a project and competition. And it's as if this person is not even recognizing who you are. This person is just, um, um, you know, moving forward in their life. And I don't even think this person, you know, is aware of uh, what you're doing because this person has no, they're not people who compete with anyone. Um, you know, competition is always created by fire sign people because uh, you guys like to, you know, show up that you are competing, competing, meaning that I'm not really good at what I do, but I am showing the world that I am. That is basically competing because if you notice, a lot of people do not compete because they don't, uh, um, they don't need to compete because they're aware of what they're doing. So I see a lot of you fire sign people were having some sort of a competition with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person at the workplace. And you have created a whole lot of issue for this person. And I see um, the bosses or um, people in power recognize what you have done um, to this woman when she was working there or this woman um, or a other woman is going to be recognizing that you, Aries, were the one that have created a whole lot of issue for a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn woman, and they're going to be bringing it to an end and resolving it. Uh, and some of you, um, some sort of a resolution that you were dealing with um, is going to be resolved, some sort of a resolution at the workplace, some sort of a, a re resolution is going to be uh, um, resolved in a very, very positive way. So problems, issue, Hardship, the energy of the devil, some sort of a, um, a situation from the past that you have done to a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person is going to be coming out. Some of you have used uh, this person's name to acquire some sort of a travel documents or some uh, of a car and people are now recognizing. And I see a corporation is going to be ending this. Um, some of you who are dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn um, person in a corporation, they're going to be standing their ground. And it's going to be taking back what you have done and ending. Because I see um, whoever the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person is, is really standing their grounds and saying, no, 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 you're not going to be raining on my parade of taking my information or accessing my information. And I see this person is going to be really standing up. And I see people in authority is going to be helping this person and end this situation that has been transpired. So be aware of this. So, I got to go, but um, resolution is going to be coming in. Um, the, so um, if some of you were having some sort of a conflicts with a friend or you were having some sort of a competition, this person is not in no conflicts and no competition with you. You have to recognize that um, whether this person is there, they're, they're just, you know, about doing their business. They're not focusing on you. They have no intention of having any conflicts or competition. They're just on their way, moving forward and doing what they need to do. So I'm saying namaste until next time. Welcome, Leos. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes and shares. Okay, Leos. So this week, is um, there is some falls. Right? Um, uh, there is some falls that is going on the energy of the fox is here in this week who is the fox so a lot of you um a corporation institution is looking for the fox who is the fox 
I see information is going to be coming out. Some sort of a secrecy is coming out. They're going to be recognizing some sort of a secrecy about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person. So whatever is happening and transpiring, some sort of information is coming out. They are looking for the fox, Leos. Are you looking for the fox? Who is the fox? Some sort of an emotional situation. A lot of you, Leos, is going through an emotional roller coaster and a judgment call is coming in. I see information and secrets is coming out. A whole lot of secret documents is coming out and people are finding out a whole lot of information. Now, who is a spicy cancer or scorpion person? This could be a dead person and a government institution is recognizing and is finding out what has been happening and what has been transpiring and recognizing that you Leos could have access to uh, uh, Pisces, uh, um, dead Pisces information. Someone could have accessed this and gave it to some of you Leos. Not sure how this is going in. Some of you Leos could have been uh, the one who recognized this or they're going to be recognizing what you Leos have done. So, I see some sort of information is coming in from your kids. Your kids is going to be telling you about some sort of a false play, I told you. So um, your kid is going to be, um, for who have kids, some of you new love is coming in. I see some of you young people are going to be trying to run away from a situation, but they're going to be recognizing that you have done this. So... Um, a lot of you young people between the age of 18 and 45 is going to be trying to run and they're going to be recognizing that you and the spices, because I see you're going to be letting the spices fall. Secrecy about a Pisces man and you fire sign young women are going to be letting the spices fall. They recognize that you have collaborated with the spices man and got a, a, a letter and justice is going to be coming down on you leos because they have recognized uh, that you together with your lover had to collaborate and got someone information i see they're recognizing um that uh, a aries leo or a sagittarius person i see justice coming down on this person and I see a whole lot of information is uh, um, coming out and I see uh, um, secrecy, double secrecy, secrecy about some sort of a collaboration and truth is coming out about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman. So let me get in this and uh, look at what is transpired. So a government institute, a corporation is recognizing some sort of information that um, some of you, Leo, as uh, access, uh, uh, however way, um, a Sagittarian man is going to be recognizing that some of you young Leos uh, have acquired a dead person information and their government institutes, the organization is now recognizing that some of you, Leo, as access a dead person information and as use it, and I see if you work in a government institute or organization, they're going to be coming down on you guys hard because they recognize that you have access to this uh, dead person information and has been using it. It's a dead Pisces. And I see this person is from the out of the grave, is raining terror on you, Leos, for what you have done because they recognize that you tried to work against uh, their child. And I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, because you're not aware of uh, the spirit world and how this world works. And I'm telling you, whenever the spirit world see that, uh, they don't know you, never know you in um, the living or the dead. And you access their information at the dead. They will rain on you and let the thunder come down. And this is exactly what is happening to this woman. So this is a Pisces woman. And... The government institutes the organization is recognizing that you Leo men or you Leos have access to this woman, this dead woman information. And they're recognizing that you Leos, whether man or woman, have access to this information. And I see a Sagittarian man is going to be coming down on you Leos because they recognize because uh, um, you Leos, uh, they, the three of uh, you Leos had worked together. 
where a Sagittarian man out of a government institute to corporation, um, this person could, because they're going to be coming down on this person because you and this person could have some sort of a love relationship. Uh, it's not looking like a father. It could be a, a father, but it was some sort of a love relationship or you were seeing this person. This person is the one who access a dead woman information in a government institute organization in order to give you young Leos a start and Aries, Aries and Leo. And now they're recognizing what this person have done. So this man, they're going to be coming down on the Sagittarian man because they recognize that this, this is a Sagittarian man that has access uh, some sort of uh, information and gave to a young Aries. Uh, and they're going to be finding out what this Pisces man with you Leos have done. That is the same man access and give you Pisces man this information. What a... Oh boy. Ooh. I don't know. I know Leo is kind of sick. No question about this Leo. It is kind of sick. And uh, sometimes people say, yeah, I don't know why this. I mean, honestly, if you don't have something, why are you going to access this dead woman information? Do you think... Uh, Really, that this would have, uh, um, that this would have, uh, um, not showed up. They recognize what you Leos have done. And they're finding out that you Leos and the Aries is uh, false. And that this Sagittarian man is the man, um, who, who could either recognize what you have done or this Sagittarian man is the man that has accessed this dead woman information and gave it to you guys. What a, I mean, seriously, you people are really, you really have to find, find a way to manage this situation because, uh, I mean, secrets are coming out. There is no, there is no question. Secrets are coming out. And I see that this woman, um, child is going to be protected for the, illegal situation what you people have done and they're going to be coming down really really hard on you people because they're going to be finding out that a pisces man um a pisces man is going to go to jail for this act yep oh yeah mm -hmm. yep and they're not going to let up they're going to make sure that the Spices man go to jail and a huge legal problem is going to go to the Spices man. And I see the Spices man is have to give up this Sagittarian man in this government institute organization that he is the one that has accessed this dead Pisces woman information and give it to you, Leos. It is a really sad situation. Some of you Leos could be finding out that you're... It's, um, for some of you, it's not your mom. For some of you, this government worker, um, this Pisces man paid this government worker, the Sagittarian government worker to access this dead woman information. And I see they recognize government institutes to recognize the secrecy of what has happened. So whoever had done something false, they're going to be recognizing. I see they're going to be trying to protect the child of this woman. Um, because they recognize what you Leos have done, that this was um, sick and had gone too far. So it is um, a fire sign man who have access uh, and all and a dead woman information and gave to you Leos. Uh, um, and the secret is all coming out now, judgment call. And I see that the Spices man could be going to jail and he deserved to go to jail because this man is, um, this man has his family. He has you as a side piece, Jacob. And he had befriended this woman, child, in order to get her information to give you, go to jail. You deserve going to jail. You're a sick person, very sick person. So I see um, they're going to be recognizing because some sort of a news is going to be coming in. Um, justice is coming down. Um, they are, you know, some of you Leos, your child could be taken away from you because they recognize, so, um, what you have done. And some of you Leos, um, 
your child could be taken away from you there is justice and there is a situation with your child but if for some of you if your child was taken away i see justice is going to be coming um justice is going to be protecting a child and this child is a pisces cancer squirt and this is between the age of 18 and 45 justice recognize this child and the connection with this child and its mother and it's going to be recognizing that you, Sagittarius, is not this child. And they're going to be re recognizing that you, Sagittarius, are connected to a Pisces man. And this Pisces man have asked someone um, in civil service to access this dead woman information and gave it to you guys. Jesus Christ, this is just so sick, people. I'm sorry. This is really sick. I mean, in God's name, don't you people have any respect for the dead? And the Spices man and the Sagittarius man could find themselves in a, a, in jail centers because I see justice is coming down. Um, justice is going to be coming down because they're going to be recognizing that a Pisces man together with a Sagittarius man as it is the one that access a dead Pisces woman information in a government institute or organization. And I see um, justice is going to be working in order to take down the situation because they found out the secrets of what you have done. I see they're going to be protecting a Capricorn person because they re re recognize that the Capricorn person is the lady's daughter or the latest, yeah, it's, it's a Capricorn person, it's the latest daughter or the latest child. It's not you, Leos. It is a sick thing. You know, you really sit and think about what you have done. How dare you disrespect someone else's dead mother? Because they're going to be um, finding out that you and a Pisces man, together with a Sagittarian man, is the two person that access that woman information. And they're going to be recognizing that it's both of you have this um um networking and i see some sort of a um a news is going to be coming in um and secrets is going to be coming out because they're going to be recognizing that you um that the spices man had befriend the woman child in order to recognize and know that the woman child was living in another country so the spices man um, you had no paper and you were illegal and you're going to try to run for it. But justice is going to be coming down because they're going to be recognizing what you have done. I don't know. Let it go. Um, Leos, the rest of you, Leos. I see the rest of you, Leos, is working in collaboration. Um, and I see that they're going to be recognizing justice is going to be coming down on you, Leo, man. You, Leo men, justice is going to come down on you, Leo men. Um, and you're going to be having some sort of a huge lawsuit and a judgment call is going to be coming down because they're going to be seeing the secrecy that you, Leo men, the secrecy of you, Leo men. And they're going to be recognizing um, some sort of information and how you, Leo men, work in collaboration in order to give a younger Leo person and a, and, and a Aries person information. Um, a Pisces Cancer Scorpion person is going to be um, some of you are going to be receiving some sort of a um, letter from a Pisces Cancer Scorpion man to help you but i see that um you're so far up in um a lawsuit and all the secrets has come out so it is a it is a complex situation a lot of you leos are dealing with um government institutes and organization and justice is coming down on a network a sort of a secrecy secret network and it has to do with a pisces man um a leo man a sagittarius man and they're recognizing that um you leos was in an affair with a pisces man you you leos between the age of 18 and 45 was in a relationship with an old pisces man and that old pisces man is the 
person that access uh, someone else's information in order to get you a stay in a country and has taken tax money on the that person name pretending that you were the person and has also access uh, um um information of this person and they're going to be recognizing that the lady is dead and the Pisces man has given you a dead person information and they're going to be taking down this network and I hope, I hope, I hope that the Pisces man go to jail. It's a sick thing that they have done. I got to go, ladies and gentlemen. This is kind of a disturbing reading. Um, and some of it, it could be happening to you. Some of you, you just deliberately didn't have a stay in a country. You have created a whole other issue. And you find someone in order to pay and get someone else's information. And this, this, this man is a real sick criminal and he should not see the light of day anymore because of what he has done. And the thing about it is that this man has a family. This man has a family and that you're going to be going so far to get yourself in some sort of a criminal act. Don't you have respect for the debt? You know that this lady child is somewhere else and you use the dead woman information to give your side piece, Jacob, a stay in another country. You should not see the, the light of day. It is a very disturbing thing. You are disturbed. This um, whole situation is very disturbing. I gotta go. Welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. All right. So I see long-term stability and some sort of a success is going to be coming up. That is going to be good. Whatever was happening on transparent, people are now recognizing a lot of things. A lot of truths are coming out. People are, are really um, understanding. So success, um, a lot of you are going to be successful over a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion, and a Aquarian man, whoever these people are. These people um, has been accessing data and taking people information. And I see they are aware that these people were selling information. And I see they're going to be coming down on these people. Then I see the energy of the star and some sort of a good news is going to be coming in for you Sagittarian in this week. And I see some sort of a long-term stability um, again, so a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion. I see heartbreaks for this man. Um, I see they recognize some sort of heartbreaks uh, is coming up because they recognize something about an Aquarian or an investigator or a corrupt police, what they have done, or a corrupt uh, civil servants, what they have done. Then I recognize uh, that a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion person had worked together with a corrupt um, person in order and pay this person in order to acquire some sort of a documentation and I see truths is coming up. So the four of pentacles, they are um, seeing what was happening and transpiring. I see some good news is coming in that you're going to be overcoming a situation where a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person have created. They're recognizing this person. I see worries for this young woman, whether this young woman or man is, worries for this person. Um, I see some sort of an offer is going to be coming in for you Sagittarians because you Sagittarians recognize what this young person is doing. I see a judgment call is coming up for a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person. I see three witches. They came down on these people, whoever these three witches are. Um, I see that um, people in authority recognize that these three person was working against some of you. I see an offer of a whole lot of money is going to be coming in. They recognize that three women together, this woman, Taurus, where we're Capricorn, together with two other women were working against you. I see they're investigating a whole lot of money where a whole lot of money had gone. They recognize that a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion man had collaborated with you guys and had intercept and took a whole lot of money. I see you Sagittarians are going to be sitting pretty. Thank God for that. Um, some of you Sagittarian are going to be receiving some sort of a money because I see you Sagittarian work together in order to resolve a situation. And I see is that they're going to be saying, oh my God, 
Um, it's, it's, it's as if some of you Sagittarian recognize that you have done something against someone in the past that was not good. And uh, it got way out of end until the person nearly lost their lives. So, and I see you Sagittarian are realizing, Jesus, I never expected this to go so far. But it went um, too far. And I see that you Sagittarian begin now to kind of help this person because you rec you were not aware that it has it would have gone so far. And I see you Sagittarian uh, is realizing that three people, um, it could have been three people at the workplace um, or three people that you were connected to, have collaborated and stolen a lot of money. A lot of money. And I see that this had gone so that it could have been investigated. And they investigated this. And I see they're going to be returning the money to an older Taurus, Vir um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn businesswoman. That a lot of money. These three women have collaborated together. And you can see this. That this, this is a ringleader that um, had offered these people some money in order to co to collaborate together and i see where is this for this person now and they're recognizing you sagittarian are helping people in authority to resolve and um get this money back to this lady because you, you are so sorry to what has transpired you're re really sorry i see you sagittarian are really sorry because you did not know that a situation would have gone so far. And, and that is it with you, Sagittarian. It's as if you recognize Jesus. Jesus, I didn't expect all of this to happen. And I see some good news is going to be coming in because they're going to be finding where where this where this how this money was taken. And um they're going to be um able to return this money to this lady, either the lady business or to the lady, okay, because it's an older well-known woman that uh, um, recognized that there was some sort of a theft. So a bank or financial institution, a judgment call is going to be coming down on a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion man. They have recognized that this man, along with three other women, has access um, someone else's uh, tax account or bank account or information and use it to acquire a whole lot of uh, wealth they're investigating three women now and recognizing what these three women have done. Then I see good news is coming in and some sort of an offer is going to be coming in and a lot of money is going to be returned um, to some of you Sagittarian because they're realizing um, that these three women took the money for themselves and it was money that was supposed to pay it out to, to this lady and these three women lied and took the money and said that they were going to be giving it to this lady and took it for themselves. And I see that um, someone from a bank financial institution investigate and recognize that these three women have been using someone else's identity in order to facilitate themselves financially. And I see they're going to be caught. Okay. So good news is coming in. You're going to be receiving an offer. A bank or financial institution is going to be apologizing to you about what has happened and transpired because they recognize that it is true. They recognize that um, three women have collaborated together together with this man and has took money on the false pretender um, saying that you had asked them to do it and they're now recognizing that these three women are not who they say they are and they're investigating where is the money and they're going to be finding out where is the money. I see heartbreaks for a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. Um, some of you, um, Sagittarian, is going to be finding out that this person took a whole lot of money and used a whole lot of money and bought herself a rover. Okay, the Vogue. <laughs> oh my God. Saji. You know, I love you, Sagittarian, and why I love you, Sagittarian, um, is because I also have Sagittarian. Um, I'm Cup Sagittarian, and uh, Sagittarian, we are like this. We love you. You will receive the world, and uh, you know, 
we protect certain people, but when we recognize that we really did something to get somebody's life or um, then we are going to be stepping back. Because once you realize that, hey, no, I, I no, I nearly cost this person my life. I see you, Sagittarian, really stepping back and is going back and is uh, um, really trying to resolve a situation. And I see that you are going to be making sure, because it's as if you, Sagittarian, think, Jesus, this is not what I've expected. And I see you, Sagittarian, is really going to be really standing up and uh, it's going to be standing up and it's going to be going back in order to resolve an issue, okay? Because you re recognize uh, um, that this young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person um, together had offer three other women someone else's information and you are thinking, oh my God, that was not how it was supposed to go. Why did this woman do this? And you're going to be recognized that this woman did it out of hate. And you're going to be thinking, no, I don't want to have, be a part of this. Okay, I asked you to access her information, but I didn't ask you to sell her information. And I see you, uh, Sagittarius, is really going to stand up and, and starting to help um, civil service or starting to help people to investigate to realize where the money go and they're going to be finding out that this lady who you have asked to access some documentation have sell the documentation to three other women and this man okay this is a pisces cancer scorpion man and i see judgment call is going to come down on this one because they recognize that that is what this man has been doing, selling people information for a very long time. And I see that they're going to be holding on this man and that this man must pay back every cent with interest because of what he has done. They recognize that this man was very, very deceptive and what this man have done was very deceptive. And, you know, this man have kids and people are going to be recognizing what this man have done. I see, you know, Good news is going to be coming in Sagittarian that judgment call came down on this man and these three women and um, a, a bank or a financial institution is or a, an, or a government institution is going to be helping you Sagittarian in order to balance the situation because this is very worried because uh, they come, they recognize that you Sagittarian was the one who asked uh, um, this young lady to access the information but what she has done by selling the information four times is not what you um, had asked for. And you are now in some serious problems, Sagittarian, because this woman went, you asked this woman to access some information. The woman went and accessed the information. And then the lady went and sell the information. And you, Sagittarian, and now um, I see a whole lot of uh, worries for this person because she used the money and bought herself. Woo! A, Ro a Land Rover. And you, Sagittarian, is going to be thinking, Jesus Christ, what is really? Um, you, Sagittarian, is going to be blown off, blown away, recognizing that this woman has bought herself a, a Land Rover with money that was not hers, basically, because she said to you, um, transfer the money to me because she's here. The lady wasn't there. The lady went back um, to her country. The lady wasn't there. The woman had lied. And because of hate and jealousy, I've took money and sell the lady information on top of this. And, you know, I don't know, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, what is wrong with this world? There is some really sick people. I see this person is trying to get them um, because um, she offered it to three other women plus um, a, a, a Pisces, a, a Pisces man, and I see you're going to be victoriously overcoming this situation. What a horrible ordeal! This is like eight in the highest form, and I see you, Sagittarius, are really going to be uh, resolving this situation because it was not supposed to go the way you just wanted to information, but this woman has gone um, a two step further and sell the data to other people. I see these uh, three women in a bank or financial institution is now looking and researching 
um some money and i see that uh, um this taurus Virgo capricorn woman is sitting very good because i see that uh, um people in civil service is going to be coming down on three women in a um, bank or financial corporation and is recognizing that these three women have not been doing their jobs and is seeing so i see you sagittarius is going to be on top of your game you sagittarians are going to be recognizing and the thing about it is that you sagittarians are going to be it's as if you realize that you have a, a created a whole lot of issue for someone that did not deserve it because this person have their own fair chance of problems and i see that you're going to be making sure that this situation is resolved because this person didn't um um, res um you know didn't deserve this so oh my god you let me have tears come to my eyes so such sharon it's going to be a good week um i see you're going to be overcoming what a young taurus virgo or capricorn this verse is between the age of 18 and 45 what this woman have done and could have gotten you and your your company or your business in trouble because of uh, um, accessing, selling and taking money on the false pretend. They are now investigating a bank or financial institution is now investigating and recognizing what has happened and transpired. I do love you, Sagittarian. Please uh, thumbs up, share these videos, let other people um, can find these videos. And um, remember to use the stamp, the timestamp and share, share, share. Thumbs up. I will speak to you next time. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. <clears throat> Ophiosis, this is the third week of uh, the year 2021. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Let's look and see what is going on. So, Ophiosis, what we're seeing is that there was some deceptive play. Um, You're coming in... Uh, recognizing um that a young taurus Virgo or capricorn person whoever this person is is between the age of 18 and 45 have paid to get some sort of an information or some sort of a documentation now what is happening and transpiring they're coming and recognizing that a young person whether this young person is had played for pay to get some sort of information and some sort of a contract and they're recognizing this now so you ophiosis is trying to bring a situation in order you ophiosis um have realized that a man there was some sort of a deceptive play and you're recognizing this by a man they're recognizing that this man was not aware of certain things and you ophiosis are looking at the situation and realizing what has transpired so what we see is uh, some sort of a problem with um, relationship is going to be coming up, but I see a resolution, some sort of a communication um, with a relationship, but I see resolution is going to be coming in. This man is going to be realizing that a whole lot of things uh, was in balance and uh, um, it could be you men, you Ophiosis men, but you're going to be recognizing I see truths is coming out about a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. What they have done, the energy of the devil is here. And I see a whole lot of you are standing your ground. I see a whole lot of you recognize that they have done some sort of an injustice. Um, so I see you, Ophiosis, is going to be balancing out the situation. And you're finding in a strength to balance out the situation. I see some sort of a new contract. The energy of the devil is here with a contract or um with some sort of a problem that was there and they're recognizing the play that has happened and transpired so 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 let's go in and see what is happening so i see um some sort of a new contract um you of yours could be receiving or is uh, going to be getting um you're going to be balancing out a situation and making sure that uh, a situation is properly dealt with a corporation institution is recognizing that they were losing a lot of money. Um, um, a um, whoever this person is in a corporation institution, this is um, it could be a civil servant that is recognizing some sort of a deceptive play that was created. A lot of you Ophiosis is now um, taking some rest. Is going to be good, but a lot of you Ophiosis. A dream for this situation to resolve and the secrets to come out and it is now here 
a lot of you all feel just so standing your ground, standing your ground to some sort of an imbalance situation and is protecting yourself. I see they're recognizing that an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra woman was very deceptive. And uh, I see you are going to be protecting yourself or someone else from this person. And I see that you're trying to find inner strength. So Ophiosis, um, this is the first time I see you, Ophiosis, having to deal with so much strength. And I think that you, Ophiosis, recognize that there was some on fair game that was played and that there was a huge theft that was created and i see um some of you obvious this is going to take down a lawyer whoever this lawyer is or whoever this person is whether this person is an eye professional person you're going to take down this person because you re realize uh, that this lawyer or this person have created some sort of a false act okay so i see the energy of the six of pentacles whatever is happening and transparent uh, you Ophiosis is going to be helping to resolve some sort of a secrecy that an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman have together with um, a man. So you uh, Ophiosis could be investigating or recognizing. So you Ophiosis is going to be using the sword of truth to, to end some sort of a play of a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. And a corporation institution is going to be recognizing some horrible play that was played and it's going to be working in collaboration to stand and protect some of you Ophiosis from a Aquarian Gemini or Libra woman or a legal situation because they recognize that these people were just looking to bring out some sort of a legal situation and I see they realize the real deceptive play that was happening and transparent and I see you Ophiosis is going to step directly in there a lot of you are thinking whether or not you should work on your marriage or not a lot of you some sort of a help is going to be coming in for you and your partner i see some sort of an information came out and a corporation institution is very happy with the information that came out and is going to be balancing out the situation because they rec recognize how people try to work against some of you and you're going to be standing your ground and protecting yourself some sort of a balancing because they recognize the secrecy of an Aquarian Gemini or Libra woman whether it's a loyal or it is a high professional person they recognize the secrecy of this person and I see they are taking down this person because they recognize that this person is not aware of what they're doing a corporation institution is really going to be standing their grounds against this Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person because they recognize that this woman had a secret and this woman was held for blood and they're going to clip it in the bot directly. A lot of you are going to be um, protected from negative forces because they recognize that a lot of you were worked against a group of people trying to create it, some sort of a problem. So the um, um, Ophiosis stand um, strong in this week. I see a lot of you Ophiosis could be using the sword of truth and is taking down a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. Whoever this person is, you're going to be recognizing that this person is very dishonest. And um, I see an end um, is going to be coming up to a legal situation for a man because they're recognizing that this man was not aware of what was happening and transpiring and how people take, took a disadvantage of this man. And this man now is recognizing. And I see that some of you Ophiosis is going to be protecting this man and is going to be helping this man out of this situation. Some of you men could have recognized some sort of a undesirable situation that was also happening. So at work, I see a corporation institution is going to be helping some of you and it's going to be offering some of you some sort of a job. And I see some secrets. So a lot of people had secrets. So if you're married, you're, you could realize that your partner had some sort of a secrets. It's going to be coming out. I see a whole lot of you are standing your ground to protect yourself from an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person. And I see the energy of the star and I see a lot of you are standing 
and is trying to protect yourself and heal a situation that was going on. The Four of Sword is showing up some sort of undesirable theft that was going on and people are recognizing and a whole lot of you are going to be protected, okay? So they're going to be recognizing some sort of a secrecy of a man and a woman in a corporation and how they work and you're going to be standing your ground in order to protect yourself from these people and realize that these people have not been very honest. So, so uh, some of you who are in relationship with Aries Lee or Sagittarius people, you could recognize that these people have been playing you for quite a long time and you're going to be really standing up against these people and recognize that these people have been creating a whole lot of problems and a whole lot of issue for a lot of you and it's going to be understanding what is happening and what is transpiring and it's going to be taking back your power so men watch out there could be someone who is stealing from you or taking from you this could be an Aquarian Gemini or Libra person or someone could be dry, um, you know, pulling you in a lawsuit. But I see that you're going to be recognized this and just removing yourself away from this person and this situation. I got a girl. Namaste. Until next time. Remember to use the link in order to um, realize there's a lot of secrecy at work for a lot of you. A lot of secret. And they're going to be coming out because people are going to be recognizing the secrets that has been happening and transpiring and how people were secretly working against you. A corporation institution is going to be recognizing this and is going to be helping you and protecting you from what is going on because they have realized the undesirable um, play that was transpiring. I got to go. Thumbs up and subscribe share namaste welcome pisces i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back let's see what's coming up for you pisces so i see pisces some sort of a new contract is going to be coming out for some of you a hand um to some job so it says some of you have end a uh, work contract the week before you're coming in in this week and a lot of uh, um it's as if some of you end a contract because you were carrying too much burdens. It's as if this contract um, or this oh, this contract or this project was not what you were looking for. You have tried it, it didn't work, you're ending it and you're moving forward. So I see some sort of end to a job. Maybe it's in the last week or it's gonna be coming up. And you are okay. You Pisces are really okay. You Pisces are glad that it is over. Um, a lot of you Pisces were thinking, Jesus, I hand this contract, but I don't know where the next one is coming in. A next contract will be available um, even faster than you recognize it because you're now realizing that it is time that you clear up some situation and move forward. The energy of the sun is here. Your burden is, is over, Pisces, so that is good. Um, a lot of you, Pisces, are going to become your own manager. A lot of you, Pisces, I see managers are realizing that maybe um, they made the wrong choices. I think some of you, the manager is now recognizing that they have made the wrong choices. I see um, you're going to be successfully coming out of some sort of a situation. Um, with your boss so whoever is having some sort of a problem some sort of a clinch with your boss I see they're going to be recognizing that your boss who your boss is and what your boss have done a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming some sort of a legal issue and is getting out and I see um, you know some of you could be waiting to find out what is going to be transpiring and they're going to be recognizing and seeing what is transpired so i see the energy of the two of cups where some sort of a new contract is going to be coming in and some sort of a new contract could be ending okay so um conflicts is over whatever the conflicts is i see this conflicts is over um i see a lot of you had some sort of a conflicts with friends and uh, people at the workplace this is over um, I said it, it's ending. You're going to be successfully leaving the situation behind. 
a whole lot of situation with family, success with family also. And a transition is coming up for a, a person between the ages of 18 and 45. Justice is coming up on this person. A lot of you Pisces are going to be victoriously overcoming some sort of a conflict that was going on. Your burdens is ending. They're going to be recognizing and finding out the collaboration with a, <clears throat> a Gemini man, your boss. They're going to be seeing who this person is. I told you. Oh, my God. And um, they're going to be offering you Pisces love because they recognize that this Gemini man is very deceptive. Okay. And I see a new contract is going to be coming out, some sort of a new contract. So if you Pisces were looking for a job in this week, some sort of a new contract is coming out. I want to know because these cards are very dreary. So a new start is going to be coming up. Some of you were worried about that. And I see transition, a new start is coming in. So you guys are the first one. I love you Pisces so much. I really wanted to find out what was happening with these two dark cards, but it is as if uh, you were in a dark period. And if you notice, it can, uh, um, a situation with a work or a project, you were in a very dark period. And now a new start is going to be coming in. So sometimes I say to people, if you lose a job, it is time you have done this contract with these people let it go move forward because a lot of people are worried a lot of people are always worried um that a job is over yes um you have cleared the karma between those people you're moving on so i see whatever the darkness that has been um covered over you or what you were doing is now ending and i see a new start is coming out here i see money is going to be changing even though a job has been ended, some sort of a new start is coming in. And I see a transition and you're going to be receiving some sort of a new start. So that is really good. Um, um, a new offer of a contract could be coming in or um, new love could be coming in. Um, some of you could find out that you're pregnant. Okay. So the center of... Uh, um, this uh, um, week is about death and transformation. Again, you Pisces are going to be hearing that a family friend has passed away. Whatever that is happening and transpiring, whenever the energy of death comes up twice in my reading, if you are a long time watcher, you recognize this. This week is from the 18th until the 24th. Remember to use the timestamp in order to go and look at these people. So they're recognizing that a Gemini, whoever this Gemini is, this Gemini is coming up as some of you bosses. And they're going to be recognizing that if you have a boss that is a Gemini and this Gemini have a young child, not a year old, they're going to be recognizing something about this Gemini and its family. And they're going to be seeing something about this Gemini. I see an end is coming in for this Gemini. So Pisces, if you had a Gemini that was your boss, whoever this person is, they're recognizing something about this Gemini and a new contract or some communication this Gemini have given. They're recognizing that this Gemini is not being honest. So here an end is going to be coming in for this Gemini. Because they recognize that this Gemini with a contract was not honest over a contract. And they're recognizing that it's as if some of you should have um, gotten into um, long-term uh, contract. And this Gemini just cancel your contract. And they're going to be finding out that this Gemini is not being honest. So I see debt and transformation. An end for you and a Gemini. It is good. They're recognizing that this Gemini did not speak the truth and they're seeing it now. So I see um, like people in power, like people in government is re realizing that you were fired um, for the wrong reason. And I see people in government are going to be protecting you, Pisces, who were fired for the wrong reason because they're re realizing that this Gemini wasn't honest and they're recognizing it now. Okay. So the conflicts is definitely going to be over. Your burdens is going to be over. A lot of you are glad that you ended some sort of a contract. 
and you're looking forward to become your own entrepreneur and that is basically better for you Pisces so then they're going to be realizing some sort of information uh, about friends is going to be coming out and you're going to be recognizing what was going on a family people in authority is recognizing that this Gemini has worked against your family so it's as if they're going to be recognizing but I see justice is going to be coming down on this Gemini because they're going to be recognizing and going back this Gemini whoever this Gemini is and this Gemini is um like this Gemini have a baby for you or this Gemini just have a baby they're going to be recognizing that whoever this Gemini has this child with is only to stay in a country okay it's as if uh, um whoever this Gemini is people in power is going to be recognizing that this Gemini end your contract and it's because of someone either pay them or this Gemini did not want to um, to give you long term, a longer, a, you know, a permanent contract. And this is the reason why I see people in power is really looking at how you and your partner and you and your family as treated like unkindly. And for some reason, Pisces, uh, I see they're going to be recognizing who this Gemini is because now this Gemini is having without you even knowing this Gemini is now under pressure for what they have done ending your contract so even if you are not aware of this this is definitely what is transpiring they recognize the dishonesty of a Gemini with a contract and they are now um, realizing that this Gemini was not and did not treat you fairly and I see justice is sending up and recognizing this so then the energy of uh, um, you businessmen, I see they're going to be recognizing something about your family. So businessmen, um, your family could have recognized something about you or something is going to be coming out about your family. Um, and then I see the conflicts is coming to an end. And I see it's as if people in authority is going to be uh, um, protecting like some of you um um, Pisces so, and uh, I see an end is coming up like Pisces that don't have kids people in authority is going to be protecting you because they recognize how you have been treatedly unfairly so Pisces who don't have kids okay then I see an end for a family Um, they're really I see a lot of you a lot of you Pisces so, um you're going to be ending some sort of a family a friend family um connection um definitely you're going to be ending some family connection so i see um information comes out over some friends in and and people are now aware of uh, um your friend family and an end is coming up i see the conflicts is going to be over and i see an aquarian gemini or libra is going to be finding out um that uh, a child um only come in the picture because someone wanted to stay in a come in a country then i see um your hardship is going to be over so that is good and i see a whole lot of you is going to be having a new start i see information is going to be clear people are going to be clearly communicating and i see um that people are going to be recognizing what is happening so i see the energy of the the you know the, this this ending is good you guys need to let go of this and move on because this did not serve you any purpose, okay? Some sort of a new um, offer is going to be coming in that is going to be better than the one you just left behind. So Pisces, not to worry about anything. Things are going to be working out. A lot of you could be finding yourself pregnant. A lot of you um, could be deciding, um, you know, whether I should have kids. So that sort of a situation could be coming up. A lot of you are going to be recognizing uh, that there was just some really 
on a um on a like spellage that it was career and i see that you are going to be recognizing this and you're going to be moving forward and it is going to be well deserved moving forward i gotta say namaste until next time please thumbs up and share these videos welcome 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 cancers i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back all right, Cancer, some sort of a transition is coming in with some sort of a documentation, okay? Uh, it could be with work, but it is coming up as a documentation. This is the um, burden. Some situation could be at the workplace or some sort of a burden that you were going through. Some sort of a um, transformation is coming in about some sort of a document. Then we see um, a lot of you are having problems with your partner your husband or wife, whatever is happening and transpiring. I see um, a lot of uh, problems is coming up for you, cancers, with your husband and wife. I see some of you want to just walk away um, from a marriage or a relationship because they're recognizing what was happening and what was transpiring. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's look at this and let's see what was transpiring and happening. So I see um, a lot of you cancers is offering some sort of a love at the workplace so, and uh, you want a new start. But I see they have some sort of a conflicts over your contract. They are not sure whether or not they want to keep you on. Then um, this is the seven of a uh, um, sword. So there is some sort of a deceptiveness and a lot of people ask, why is deceptiveness? Seven of Swords, ladies and gentlemen, is deceptiveness. So I see love has been offered, but there, this love is not real. Um, I see people are trying to play um, face with you. I see some sort of an ending is coming in for a lot of you cancers. Some sort of a network is going to be ending for you cancers. The Seven of Pentacles. So two sevens is here for you guys in this week. Three sevens. So... A lot of you cancers could be on a new part, could be moving on a new part, could be, um, you know, going in a new direction with someone else or with a new business contract. Um, some of you could be wanting to get married, but I see some of you are having some sort of a conflict. So some of you could be already in a relationship or a marriage and you're seeing someone else and there is a whole lot of conflicts. So emotions, you have all mixed feelings. Friday will be good. It's seven at work. Let's see what's coming up um, with a project. But I see um, this week is unsettling for you cancers. And that means when the four of ones is in reverse, that means it is unsettling. So I see you're trying to balance out some sort of a situation with a relationship. Um, I see... Um, um, they're recognizing um, the deceptive play of an Aquarian woman. I see now she is in a lot of problems trying to find inner strength. Double deceptiveness, Cancer. Double, double deceptiveness with an Aquarian woman. They are recognizing what this Aquarian woman has done. So they recognize that an Aquarian woman have created a whole lot of deceptiveness and now this person is trying to find inner strength because um, this woman pulled a card and pulled the wrong card. Yes, this woman and her partner tried to create some sort of a problem and they recognize uh, um, that this lady was lying. Oh my God, an end is coming up for these two um, people. Um, they recognize uh, whoever these two people is, uh, um, if you are in a relationship with an Aquarian person, they lied. They have been seeing someone else and um, their love was not real. They are, they have been seeing someone else for quite some time, Cancers, and you were not aware of this. Whoever this Aquarian woman is, have been cheating on you um, big time. Now, for some of you, this person has not been honest and has been cheating on you big time. For some of you, this Aquarian woman is very deceptive. If you're in a relationship with an Aquarian woman, this woman has been cheating on you for a very long time. The hermit is coming out 
to shed light on a situation in a corporation institution. They're now recognizing, I see heartbreaks is coming up for some of you cancers. A bank financial institution is going to be holding on, on you cancers. I see they recognize um, that uh, some sort of a horrible play against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn was done. And I see um, some sort of a, a help is going to be coming in for a couple that you cancers have really worked against. Whew, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. Okay, so what we're seeing here is that um, you cancers was seeing an um an Aquarian woman, whoever this Aquarian woman is, it was false love that this person had given. I end this coming up. This woman have her relationship, and I see heartbreaks for this woman. And uh, whatever has transpired, her partner could have found out that you cancers was seeing this woman, and her partner is going to be recognizing that this woman has been lying the whole time. I see some sort of a balance is going to come in because an end is coming into this um, play that was transpiring because light is now shed on a corporation institution and I see heartbreaks is going to be coming in a whole lot of emotional situation for you cancers and it's because of this Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person that they're going to be recognizing who this lady is, I end this coming up for this lady, and I see heartbreaks so, um, for you cancers. Um, and some of you cancer in a corporation, light has been shed that you had an affair. Okay. Woo, cancers. A lot of you cancers had an affair with an Aquarian woman and they're realizing that you and this Aquarian woman um, was cheating. I see that they recognize the play that you and this Aquarian woman have created some sort of a deceptive play and I see heartbreaks for you cancers now because light is now shedding that you cancers at work against a Capricorn woman and created a whole lot of issues um, for this Capricorn woman and her families and friends. And I see that a new start is going to be coming up for this Capricorn woman, but not for you cancers because you cancers have not been honest. And light is shedding on a house and you and your partner and how you try to cheat this woman out of a lot of money. An end is coming up for whoever had a lawyer or an Aquarian woman that was creating some problems. I see the end. They realized that a lawyer had stolen or taken or lied and heartbreaks for this lawyer. And you cancers are in the middle of it because this, this situation is affecting you cancers because you cancers could have been cheating with this Aquarian woman and this Aquarian woman is now in some problem. Light has been shed and they're recognizing people at the company or um, is recognizing that you had an affair with this Aquarian woman. So they caught you cancers men you cancer men have been having a long time affair with a aquarian gemini or libra woman and they recognize that you use this woman to work against a taurus virgo or a capricorn person and they caught this woman and this woman is going to be um saying that you were the one who asked you you were the one who asked her to do this and paid her to do this. O-M-G. Woo! Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. For the rest of you cancers who have been really working on a positive um, direction, I see some sort of a conflict coming in with you and your partner. Some sort of a conflict is coming in. Some sort of a changes is coming in with a contract for some of you cancers. Some sort of a 
problems with your wife and husband or a long-term partner we are recognizing this and we are seeing this happening light is going to be shedding on a whole lot of money a bank financial institution could be finding out that some of you cancers have took money that was for a taurus virgo or a capricorn that some of you cancers have stolen to work together and collaborated and stolen a whole lot of money that was for a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. And I see that they're going to be making sure that this Capricorn woman um, receive every cent of this money because of what you have done. I end this coming in for an Aquarian or a lawyer, whoever this Aquarian is or this lawyer. I end this coming in. This person recognized that some of you can just use her in order to get to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman and that um, uh, some of you cancer men was cheating with this woman for a long time. First you were with a Capricorn woman, then you went to this um, Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman and they're recognizing that you have been cheating with this woman and in an affair with this woman for a long time. Oh my God. People at your work is going to be letting them know that uh, you have been seeing this Aquarian and Gemini woman. I see heartbreaks is coming up. I see this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman is standing her ground. Some of you Cancers who had an affair with this woman, I see this woman turn her back on you and recognize that you were having an affair with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. And this is the reason why she no longer, and she ended the relationship because she realized and she recognized uh, um, that you were lying. And she realized and recognized uh, the first time you went with this Aquarian woman. And I see now your wife found out, and I see your a whole lot of conflicts. And I see a whole lot of conflicts and your wife, whoever this person is, is going to divorce you and leave you because your wife is going to be recognizing that it's not only one person, but it's two person you have had an affair with. So a lot of you cancer men, a whole lot of information is coming out that you had an affair with first a Taurus Virgo Capricorn person. She ended it because she recognized that you were very dis dishonest and light is now been shed in that you are in um, an affair for a very long time with an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person. I see heartbreaks is going to come up for this person because I see the wife is going to be confronting this person and um, really, you know, really recognize it. And this person is going to say, yeah, but I'm not the only person he had an affair with. He was seen at Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. And ladies and gentlemen, leave this woman out of it because this woman don't even want to get mixed up in all of your thing because this lady is like, uh, this lady found out and quick, right away she ended, she clipped it, she said, no way. So this woman don't want to be um, involved. I see this Aquarian, Gemini or Libra woman is going to be thinking about um, leaving you cancers, heartbreaks is coming up for this woman. Um, this woman is is heartbroken because of um, some sort of a deceptive uh, play that was created and this woman got caught up in it. This woman is trying to find inner strength to deal with it and she's trying to balance out her situation and recognizing because light has been shed. People know the truth. People know that she was having an affair with you, cancers, and people are recognizing that you cancers have worked against and tried to deceive a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. And I see truth is coming up. So I see a lot of you cancers are really regretting what you have done because information came out. Um, however, they found out the information. They recognized that you cancers was first cheating with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. And this person I've recognized what you have done and this person have let uh, walk away from you and end the friendship. They don't even have a friendship with you anymore. They recognize that you were very deceptive and they caught you. So I see you and your wife and I see um, a lot of you um, cancers 
want a new start, but this this, this um, Aquarian woman is uh, not going to be taking you in. And this is a sad situation that you have your family, your wife and your family. And, uh, you know, this is really to teach you um, Pisces, so you Cancer something because this woman was had no intention of, uh, you know, getting married and settling down with you. This woman was just someone who, um, this woman just liked to be with other people who are in relationship or married. There's something wrong with this lady. And now you're regretting. I see a lot of you cancers are regretting um, that you cheated on a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman. And you're now recognizing that this lady knew that you cheated on her because here it is. It says some of you cancer men wants to balance out um, a relationship and a friendship with a Capricorn woman. And this woman is like, nope, nope. Ah, you have dragged me in the ring when you were cheating on this woman, married to this one, cheating on uh, me with this one. No, 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 please. And I see your marriage is going to be ending. And you want to reconnect with the stars, with the Capricorn woman, but the Capricorn woman, ooh, no, it's better you move away because the Capricorn woman know that you cheated on her. So I see an Aquarian woman and, and their partner, some sort, you know, some sort of a problems for you and your Aquarian wife or your Aquarian side piece chick or your Libra wife or your Libra. I see a Libra woman and her partner is in some serious trouble because they're now investigating this Libra woman company um, together with her partner and recognizing. Um, and I see heartbreaks. I see a hand is going to be coming in to this corporation, this business, because they recognize that they have not been um, doing, you know, doing their business, doing their work um, and uh, um, have been cheating a lot of people so 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 oh my god i gotta go cancers namaste thumbs up likes and share welcome scorpion <laughs> scorpion okay scorpion um xe dot as i come on um director is uh, um Director Pacha Zakamon. Um, again, um, authority, um, Pacha Zakamon. This Zakamon is a steer mark of Stenbok. So, he no could really see what this man have done. And a helpful problem. I see, um, you have an issue with the Ram Leo of, uh, Ram Leo of uh, a Sagittarian person. Uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarian person and um, it's a business word called block now on um, that mention is now from of the author that there's a man have career he'll fail lies and deceptiveness and have uh, um, and get get uh, and receive money in um, some uh, create money um on the false pretend this this Aries Leo or Sagittarius man they're now recognizing what this man have done. And I see people in authority is on to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man and they're recognizing who this man in and what this man has done. So I see the energy of uh, number 22 is multiple opportunities that is going to be blocked or multiple business that is going to be blocked that and Aries Leo or our Sagittarian man had because they recognize uh, how this man worked together with an, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man in order to acquire wealth on the false item. So this is coming out. So young people, not only young people, but young people, it's like your know, wishes and dreams is going to be coming in and some good news is going to be coming in because it's as if... Uh, some of you were young people were controlled by a businessman, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn businessman. Whoever this businessman is, is really deceptive and is connected with an Aries Leo or a fire sign man. And they realize now the lies 
um, of an Aries Lear by a signed man and how this man has um, um, cultivate his money. A lot of you young Scorpions was under the control by a Taurus Virgo businessman and they're realizing what this man has done to some of you young Scorpion. I see love is going to be offered to you young Scorpion for what they have done to you and money is going to be returned to you. A lot of you young Scorpion was being extorted by, um, by this businessman and I see you're finally going to be re released uh, and your wishes and dreams is going to come through. Your money is going to be coming back and they're going to be recognizing that this Aries Leo Sagittarius man um, is the biggest player. That this man is the one that give you, um, send this man on, on your part, um, Scorpion. This man, this, this, these two men are really sick. Um, in the way that they um, get their money and it's not a healthy way. Um, people lose their lives. Uh, people are targeted by these two men. These two men target people and lie and create false business. And I see um, that you got caught up in it. And I see that they're going to be releasing you young scorpion. Okay, um, because your wishes and dreams is going to come true. Some good news is going to be coming in. Uh, um, from this person because this person recognized um, that this man is a liar and um, um, they're going to be releasing you. Love is going to be offered to a lot of you Scorpions and money is going to be returning. They're now recognizing this businessman and they're going to block this businessman and his business because they recognize how this businessman come on his money and his business. So good news is going to be coming in. Money is going to be returning to you. They recognize that an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius man has stolen a lot of money and they're going to be returning this. So some good news is going to be coming in. I see um, people are going to be apologizing. Love is going to be offered to you and they're going to be recognizing how oh, this fire sign man here, how oh, this fire sign man have lied and created a lot of problems for you guys. So, so I see, yes, you're going to be successfully overcoming an, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn businessman. A money is going to be returned to you because they have recognized what this man have done. Then um, I see again for of Pentacles, this man have to pay you um, a Scorpion a whole lot of money because they recognize that this man um, is a liar. Good news is going to be coming in twice, so double whammy with good news about money. And also, um, they're going to be protecting you. An offer is going to be coming in for you, Scorpions. This is good because they recognize so, that you, Scorpions, were on, uh, were treatedly unfairly. Okay, they do recognize that. Then I see um, the Wheel of Fortune. Wow, Scorpions, this is good. And the star in the Wheel of Fortune could buy a scratch off or a lotto in this week. They find out the lies and deceptiveness of a Aries Lee or a Sagittarius man in a, a, a corporation institution. I see news is going to be coming in from this company. And I see that they're going to be um, um, finding out uh, that this night of light, this is a young person and that this young person have stolen a lot of money. And I see that you, Scorpion, is going to be recognizing who is this young person and they're going to be catching this young person and blocking this young person and this fire sign man. Yay, yay, yay. Whoopee. Okay, so... Oh my God, what a horrible, horrible. They're going to be realizing that a... Um, Pisces cancer or scorpion person worked together with a fire sign man and gave this fire sign man some sort of information and documentation to give to this young person. So it is a situation where some sort of an offer is going to come up for you. Um, an offer is going to be coming up for you scorpions because uh, 
You Scorpions, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming through. Good news is going to be coming in about money, but also news of money returning to you and also news of offer, a business offer that is coming up. And people are going to be, um, this Wheel of Fortune uh, is good because new love is going to be coming in from a corporation institution that have realized that a fire sign man has been lying and this fire sign man is the one worked together with a young Pisces cancer or scorpion and took a lot of money from this person and this fire sign man has been lying and holding um this young person at ransom it is not showing up so it could be um you um um Pisces um you scorpion something with a Pisces they are going to recognize that a Pisces man is the one that gives a fire sign woman some documentation and money and they're going to block it they're going to block it because they recognize that this young fire sign person have lied and created some sort of a problem and get money and uh, information and it's this fire sign person who have given this pisces person um the documentation to give to this um fire sign person and they're blocking this young aries leo or sagittarius this businessman they're blocking them you can see that because a, a, a government institute to organize um recognize that this pisces cancer scorpion man um lied lied and and they and i work with this uh, um two fire sign men in order to career and get money in order to give to this young aries leader fire sign person and they're going to be blocking these two men their operation and this young fire sign person they're going to be blocking so i see um you scorpion is going to get good news good news um, about this Aries the or Sagittarius person, um, you're going to be recognizing and getting good news. So good news is coming in and also money is going to be returned from this fire sign person because they are realizing that this fire sign person is the one that took money. A lot of you are going to be victorious, successful, a new offer is going to be coming in. Money is going to be coming here. Now, I want to find out something because... Uh, I see this little person is skating our way out. Whether it's a man or a woman, but this person is going to be blocked because they recognize, because they blocked this person because they recognize that this person I took a lot of money and they're now finding out um, how this person has uh, gotten this money and they recognize that it's a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion gave this person the money. So let's see. This... Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, what is the news you're going to be hearing about this Aries, Leo, Sagittarius? What is the news? Uh-huh. Okay. All righty. So if you notice, ladies and gentlemen, the news you're going to be hearing about this young Aries, Leo, and fire sign person. Let me turn it up. Um, commun information is coming in. Okay. That is the bird communication. Um, and people in power there again, that his government managers recognizing that this person is a fox. Okay. So I see the investigate this person and recognize that this person is a fox and this person was carrying false documentation that was for someone else. And the person that gave this person the false documentation is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person that worked together with a fire sign man that got the information and gave it to this person. And they're recognizing this now. So I see that a block and they're going to be blocking this young um, Taurus Virgo, a Capricorn person, a bank, a financial institution, a tax company is going to be blocking this uh, um, fire sign person because they recognize that this young Aries Leo or Sagittarius, so, um, they have investigated and recognized that this person is false and is the fox. And this person had worked with um, these two men and this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man. 
um, lied and got the information and give it to this person. So I see the tax people are going to be really coming down and blocking all of these people because they recognize the lies and deceptiveness that they have created. Wow, 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 wow. So good news is coming in. A lot of money is going to be returning. I see a government institute, so your corporation is going to be offering you some sort of a um, uh, get out of a situation. And they are going to be um, recognizing that a letter and a, um, was um, a Pisces Cancer Scorpion person. The letter was stolen and it was a Aries Lee or a Aries Lee or a Sagittarius man has stole the letter and give it to um, an uh, Aries Lee or a Sagittarius person. They're going to be blocking all of these people because if you notice, the fire sign men, both fire sign men with an Aries, Aries Lee or Sagittarius, they were lying and they're going to be blocking these people. So I see multiple blocks is going to be coming up for these two men and this um, young um, fire sign person, Aries Lee or Sagittarius. This person was open for some sort of a new start. They're going to be finding out that this person is a, a fox. That means this person is dishonest uh, and is a fox. And they're going to be recognizing that the letter, a letter that you Pisces, you Scorpion had, especially a young Scorpion, you had a letter and uh, it is a fire sign person who have stolen the letter. Okay, and they're going to be blocking this fire sign person because they recognize that it's this fire sign person that has stolen the letter. Scorpions in this week uh, play uh, the scratch off, play the lottery. Uh, possibility does exist uh, that you're going to be winning. The energy of the six of wands news is going to be coming in uh, and a... Um, they're going to be recognizing as, as if uh, um, a bank or a financial institution is going to be recognizing that it is a young Pisces Gens or a Scorpion um, that had lied and took some sort of a letter and gave it to a fire sign person. And they're going to be recognizing this. Wow. So I see a whole lot of news is going to be coming in for you scorpions and the problems, the issue, the situation that was transpiring. I see, um, cause you're going to be successful. You scorpions is going to be successfully and receiving a new offer and money is going to be returning to you that a Aries Lee or a Sagittarian person between the age of 18 and 45 has stolen. They're going to be finding out that this person is really a fox. A fox is sly and is a thief, okay? I gotta go. Please subscribe, thumbs up, like, and share this video. It is a beautiful week, Scorpion. There's no question about it. A lot of good news is coming in. Um, offer is coming in. Some of you are going to be getting some sort of an unusual offer. New love is coming in. I see a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of an unusual office, um, offer from um, a huge corporation could be offering a lot of you scorpion and, and a new job namaste until next time